And he does eventually fold. Good fold. JRP tells him a good fold. But he doesn't fold before losing $218,000 to JRB. I looked at the amount of tickets. One is on the table, my friend. Huh? One is on the table. You have more, you fold, right? Sorry? You have more, you fold? I don't think so, because, like, you don't have a clean jack. You went to stand up. Maybe, I don't know. I can't fold when I bet 175. Yeah, I actually thought he would fold 10 jack on the flop. In that situation, you just say yes. What are you going to do? You can't fold. You'd love to see it. A pure coin flip. Uh-oh. How much is that? $4.50. Easy call. Once or twice. Do you have a can? Sure. One can? Two. you have two cans? Is that no good? It's good, obviously. 893K pot. Buddy. It's our money. We're going three times. Twice, twice, We're twice. going three times. Twice, go, twice. Wait, Stop. It's our money. We're going three times. Wait. There's no ruling. It's our money. We're going three times. Louis, I think we should let him. Huh? Yes, he, he wanted it, and I agreed. Louis, I think we should let him. Matt, we, we said we were going to give you five. Three, three, guys. What is the problem, right? Three, guys. Three. Okay, you guys can run it three times. Chill. I hope he gets one. Okay. I'm adding a million five. Okay. Oh, keep adding, Ben. Love it. Empty that thing out. What's going on in that bag? Can I get one of them bags? Brian, give me a bag. What the fuck brand is that bag? It's a bottomless pit of fucking shit. Okay, pulling out Monopoly money. Can you, can we, do, do you want to get an exact count of JLB's shit? <laughs> I'll do it for you. 500. Hey buddy, stay off my stack. One minute. Mind your business. One, one, two, three. Huh? What well, is exactly? Is, it, is, it, is that, is that, is that proper etiquette? Them like chopping me down? One, two, eight, five. Ben's on tilt, and I'm here for it. Adding 1.5 million over bet. Making the best fold of my life ever here. With a straighter of flush. Wow, Rob is not raising. He's considering folding. This would be fantastic. Just the idea of folding is absurd. 83. How do I not win infinite in this hand? Like, this guy is so disrespectful. That's what he said, right? The hands that 420. would probably so fold. Someone's trying to call a clock on the turn. It's a thousand big blind deep pot. Someone's calling the clock on the turn. Wesley catching up on some sleep. Durr. What are we doing? Oh, oh, you win. I know I win, probably. Uh oh. Just if I'm shoving or not. It's if I shove the river or not. I'm never folding. It's if I shove the river or not. Do I shove or not? Of course you shove. No, it's pretty close. Of course you shove. It's definitely close. You haven't got me. These two used to have beef, Doug and Tom. Wesley, you okay? If I got you fucked There's two combos. There's six, seven, two, and king, six, two. If hold in? Yeah. Let's go. All right, I'm back in the mix. <laughs> Let's go. Who is this guy? Did you three bet? Yeah. yeah I, the... <laughs> I guess. I guess now we know how to. Let's go. Let's go. Who's left? Just these two? Hands? Doug or Paul? That's not Paul. Look at you. Guess what? I like you. Oh, the, trap. the trap was set. However, Rob. Slithered his way out of it. See how red Tom Blanc's face is there. Really frustrated. Okay, oh, Tom. Annoyed. <laughs> Can't even look at him. Guys up like three million. This <laughs> is one pot. <laughs> he looks like he's. He looks like. He looks like he's just like on the verge of death. Very sympathetic. You got like one breath before. Play what? 125,000 dollars in the biggest pot we've seen so far today, and Tony G on the wrong side of it. 200,000 dollar bet from JRB, and Rob very quickly makes the call, and we've got an 826,000 dollar pot, biggest pot of the night. No, he lets it go, and Keating shows. This, this time it was, yeah. Yeah, it should be two. Yeah, he's, he's two. Yeah. Didn't do this time, though. Well, this time it was. Because there's already action, so you can't change the action now. Well, one thing about you is you always know shit. <laughs>
<laughs> and we have a cooler. Top two against bottom set. I fear for Alan Keating's stack, but boat over boat. I fear no more. Keating is going to win a huge one. Well, the only guy putting real chips in the, in the pot. And you guys are all sitting there snug, snuggling it up and then and, and, and don't want to fucking. Okay. Don't worry about it, dude. I'm, I'm, I'm stuck 220 after after playing eight minutes. And you guys want to change the unchanged lines. It's all right. Go ahead. You guys start rocking and rolling and then have something to say. And JRB is going to call quickly. And aces for max value. Wow, aces, that, that's the setup. Right. Oh, this is so fucking lucky. Look at this. I, I, I am about to whinge about how little I want in the hand, though. <laughs> <laughs> JRB's the best. <laughs> <laughs> if, if it's just like a fucking three on the river, you just I get him for like a two hundred ball. Nick Airball with jocks. Oh, okay. Where do you? Hey, he's gonna muck. Yep. You gotta get change of scenery. What's that? You gotta get change of scenery. Yeah, yeah, I like that. I like that. I like that. He could have. He could have had it. And he would have flopped a set of jocks here. And he's gonna get paid off. Rampage here. Trips over trips. And he lays it down. Wow. And of course, Airball has Hold to show. Aces. Fucking stinks. That was like a fucking setup hand. That wasn't like fucking unbelievable. That's just not, not normal. Folded ice? That's like fucking sick. Okay. I quit, I quit, I quit, I quit. I, quit. I, I play, I play, I quit. It's okay, I quit. I play. On your bike! <laughs> On your bike, Tony! You and your aces! Back to Santa Monica! <laughs> I have never seen that. He's gonna... That's. <laughs> I know. You're playing that. <laughs> and that's why it's great for the game. Not that I care. Uh, yeah, I'm uh, so happy to bluff the guy. I didn't, work. I didn't know about the stand up game. I didn't know he showed it. <laughs> so insulting. So Boogie looks like he just you could have called him ran three up, miles okay. on the beach in the middle of summer. What's up? Nice put nice on. Damn it. 20, 20, 20, 20. Are we oh. Yes. Oh, oh, she's got the ace. Oh, Damn it. Oh, I didn't think she had it. Nice hand, then. Oh. DK is going to take this one down. <laughs> so that's the stand-up game too that's that caused Alex to do that, I think. She's still looking for her marker along with Raber, Hillary, and I believe Brazil God. Me and Badger. Yeah, is he scared, you think? Yeah, he's scared. Yeah, I was scared. He, he's trying to make the, the nuts, otherwise he doesn't bet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah that's, that's, that's that's he's scared he's scared that you might check mm. raise bet bet with him, right? Yeah. Scared. Yo, this is out of line. This is out of line. I'm dumber than I look. Well done, Wesley. <laughs> well done, Wesley. I said everyone else with three bet was ace queen. What? Except for you. <laughs> everyone else except you with three bet was ace queen. Are you deaf? Yes. Apparently. Mm. Oh, little bit Chinese, good baby. Yeah. Look at that look. Pretty good. Shimi, you're in trouble the rest of the way. Oh, oh there's a jack. <laughs> Come and see one go to town. What's up? Yeah. Today, jack, go lucky card. Wow. Oh, wow. oh and there's the, another jack. Emergency <laughs> school. And Sashimi needs a king, or Peter is going to scoop, and he does. Gets it in bad. 
and wins a pot of almost $133,000. Uh, so Nick does get the scoop. Brittany finds both the fours. Oh, he folds. Wow, I did not see that coming. And of course, we're gonna have to take a closer look. Five. Hey, 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 that's you, that's you, now, that's you. Now six yeah. will come, see. Okay, Satoshi. Two pair <laughs> for Satoshi and Anthony looks sick. Now six will come. Oh, nine! He's Trip dead! Nines. He's dead! What is Mariano doing? What is, why is he smiling? It's snapped off by Charles's flush. And Charles wins a $142,000 pot with seven deuce of clubs. Walker, did you put your What a strange off? hand. Do you think this is PLO? Do you think your blockers work here, Professor? Crafts doesn't come my way. I know, right? What hey, is everybody. going on here? Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's your birthday! It's your birthday! Happy birthday! It's your birthday! Happy birthday! It's your birthday! Happy birthday to this gal! Happy birthday! It's your birthday! Happy birthday! Have some fun! Oh, you got some right here. <laughs> so painful, man. Looks like he's gonna release, and we're gonna see it in both Mars and Andy. Are gonna jump out of their seats. A scramble. Oh my I knew it. God. God! Fuck, man, I knew it. I, I, I had a feeling too, Mars. It's uh, seven five. It's not even five eight. Three nine, right? I have three five. God damn. Not even five eight. I also do the black, black on top. Back it up. Look at this. Three five. Three five. Three five. Oh, man. Oh, my God. You win. Oh, the ace on the turn. Wow. Watch out, watch out, Mars. Ace queen. Ace queen down. You win. Lucas got King Jack. That's the read. Did they side? Yeah. Let me see. Nice. That's good, eh? I call. He calls! Look at that! Shit, how can you get aces so easily? Max value! You had a bear you got, I can have. Lucas got an 80. Keith, you have, I mean, you have an out. Good thing. Keith! Oh my god. I can have. Yeah. I'm so tilted. Two things, anyone can get it. Nice, him. Give him another 10k, Link, like, do something. Queens again, Link. Finally, Professor does let it go. What a bluff from Stanley. Oh, a bluff? Wow. Hey, hey. You'll see Nicely screen. done. Yeah, I almost called. But somehow I changed my mind in the last minute. There's sunburn. Oh, he breaks oh. out. Yeah. Six, three o'clock. Some three clock? Oh yeah, they had to get oh, on him. That's a lot to miss. <laughs> Thanks for pointing that out. Ling Ling. Four cards. Not for me, this guy. Jeremy, look who's doing it. No, no, you still hate your seat. Your old friend, Magic. I know, he was trying to steal JTC. Comes and goes. I get 40k. Not for me, this guy. Jeremy, look who's doing it. No, no, you still hate your seat. Your old friend, Magic. I know, he was trying to steal JTC. Comes and goes. I get 40k. Well, there's an eight. He doesn't have to worry about it. Yeah, he makes the gutter. All in. And all in. It's only 138,000. Yeah. You gotta let it go correctly. Lock, 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 they're, they're going to split this three ways. Ridiculous. What a run out. I mean, this is a chop. So sick. 
Chop it up. Oh, yeah. oh my god, he wrote this thing. I thought it was dead. Oh my god. I it. That's what I said. Hillary and Nate are both tilted for different reasons. <laughs> The last time I ate here the other week, I lost too. Hey, you're on. There's 34,000 people. Just try. What? You got to try to do a hard to be a physically. Ooh, there you go. Talk to him. Lock in. Try. You want to do hard to be a physically? Yeah, try, try, try. Hit me. We can go outside if you want. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hit me. Try. Come outside. Try. Try. Come at him. Hit me. No balls. No balls. Oh, this is out of line. Look at Luis coming. He's running in. He said you love to hurt me physically. Then he opened up his body. You saw how he opened up his body? I saw that. He said, hit me. Lock in. I was talking to Nick, and he started talking to Nick. Nah, you weren't talking to Nick. Stop it. It just felt like it was building. Christian, who do you got in a fist fight? I don't know. Dude. I got Wesley, man. Yeah, Wesley, Wesley's Wesley locked in. Fierce. He turned his body and said, do something. They, they really go at it, right? Good. He wasn't passive about it. Yeah, big pot energy here. This looks like it's probably going to ball in. It is. Rip it. All of it. 715,000 in the middle. Two boards, Sammy. Oh! Wow. Man. Oh. The River Queen. How much can you buy him for? As much as you want. Third. Third best player in China. I don't think Wesley counts as a player. You have to play hands to be a player. He's a spectator that sits at the table. I don't see how he can fold Chuck. Oh, you got it, you got it. There you go, you got it, you got it, and he does have it. Wow. Good hand. That's the cooler we've been waiting for for two days. It was bound to happen. You play enough poker, you see enough hands, it's going to happen. Can't really beat much. He, he lets it, it down. go. Ben making all the wrong moves right now. I didn't wow. think there was a world where he folded that. I thought. Yeah, he's I tilted out of his mind right now. He's going to take a walk. Up. There's the Ben tilt walk. I mean, I would I like to take one game. I just lost like an 850k I would probably fold there. I would probably fold there. Jammer, I never get told by a I, I, I never get told by a I, I, I sure, dude, are you kidding me? I, I sure as hell would. Airball. I know, even if I'm wrong, Rick, Rick would be happy for me to call, even if I'm wrong. I know that. Sick hearing this. And he'd be really pissed if Barn. I pulled. Clock. Airball calls the clock. Desperation move. How many seconds? Hands dead. Nick Airball gets it through. You guys all are playing tight. Let's play, let's fucking gamble. Come on, Jeremy, call. Rick's screaming at you. Wow. Listen to your boss, call. Come on, Huss. But if you let me call, I would have called. Airball. Let's go. What a More timely clock Take call. Let's bluff, come on. I think that was the difference. Put these guys to the test, Rob. Let's show them how his bosses play. You were right, Rick. I should have listened to you. Rick, that was for you, baby. Call. You win. Mm, slow roll. Place. Good call, Wesley. You finally put money in the pot. Well done, Wesley. Yeah. You can see him saying whatever he wants about me. If he wants to put on my mom, then... Yeah, he crossed the line. What you gonna do? I don't talk to him. I'm not gonna not talk to him. He just talk. I'm not gonna not talk to him. <laughs> and he's gonna fold, and Rampage gets it through. Oh my God! Unbelievable. We got a game. Wow. Hand. 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 hand of the weekend. Kids got heart. Did I lost a 25 picture? No, you blinded it out, bro. <laughs> Come on, Wes. You, you can't just give him the, the alley-oop like that. At the end of the stand-up game, heads up for rolls. Yeah, okay. let's do yeah. heads up for a mill. So at the end of the stand-up game, they're going to play one hour heads up. 
an you hour? Know, Hans is stuck. Oh, Hans is like, he's smiling, but he's hating it. He's like, really? I'm losing, man? Uh, I feel like it's a bluff. Bluff? No one time bluff. But well, you want to see it here? Uh, <laughs> shout out is really wrong. Queen Deuce. I actually going to bluff no matter what. Dog. Tilting. My Come hand. here, goddammit. Win 13,000 with the third best hand in a three way pot. You do? You locked it up. See my stand city. He locked it up, buddy. Right now, all you have to do is just say raise he full. <laughs> 274,000. <laughs> Let's see if he's going to get a raise in here. No, he's just going to call the entire way. Smooth call the entire way in a $200,000 pot for Tony G. Bro, you know what they asked me? I got called, I said, they woke me up with a call, they said there might be a seat for you. 20 minutes later, I was here with a beer in my hand, ready to go. We've I seen... nearly folded. If you bet 160, I wow. I'd put you down like, mm. you just didn't bet enough. That was one of the bigger... If you overbet the pot, I would have folded. I think I can bluff sometimes. Wow, I was going to show it. It's scary when they call your cards out and you're bluffing, right? Yeah. <laughs> it's not money until you have to explain it to your wife. <laughs> Just kidding, she hasn't got I'm not quite three times. I'm trying to trap you because I think you're weak. <laughs> Look at those chips. What's stacks and stacks. I gotta make rent this month. Clock, clock. everybody clock. clock. Me! Hold! <laughs> Hold! Chop, 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 chop. <laughs> DK's gonna win it with a pair of deuces and collect the bounty. <laughs> What an absurd hand. Thank you so much. And he's angling me in the fucking three seat. It's over. 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 It
I've never seen this before. If you show me that, he's gonna have that beard. If you show me that, he's gonna have me that beard. Thank you. Finally. Finally. She didn't even give me a second to moan about it. That's me. That's me. That's me. That's me. See? Fuck you, Apple. Get the no. Get the member out of the body.
only pass through this life once. When you get old, all you're gonna have left is your memories. So make them good. Never fall, Lord to the game and the bankroll. We gon' add it up when we get low. I know my life is black, I'm a chat pro. All in, let's go. Monday through Friday, what should we do? Catch us streaming live right on YouTube. ACL family, this is our house. Keating on the show, bet it all now. J Boogie, walk away, never overplay. Max value, max pain, this is not a game. Hit that thumbs up, let's go for a ride. Come and join the stream, we're starting at five. Raise it up. Chat Pro. Hi, Bob. The beautiful Hustler Casino here in Southern California. Just eight miles from the beach here in sunny Los Angeles. We are here for Hustler Casino Live. It is Wednesday. Big game in store for you. I am David Tuckman, and welcome. Hustle Casino Live brought to you by High Stakes Poker Productions. We have six players at the table. We've got Lauren at the table. The chips are there. The cards are there. We are ready to go. I want to thank our sponsors, WPT Global. Fresh off an amazing cruise that I have heard nothing but good things about. I'm telling you, I'm marking my calendar. Next year, I'm going on that cruise. I am not missing that again. No way, no how. Dylan Flashner, our star child, at the table. Dylan coming to battle. We got Brown Baller. We got Mariano. We got Francisco. By the way, Francisco was on the cruise. We'll introduce all these players in just a moment. There he is, at the Brown Ball uh, on X and Instagram. I know some of you can't stand the guy's laugh. I think he's incredibly entertaining, and he's a really good poker player. I'm always uh, always excited to see him on the felt. T1000. You can follow him on Instagram, at T1000JC. Of course, the one and only... The man, the myth, the legend, it is Mariano, a YouTube poker vlogger. He did my ride podcast with me. And uh, it was really, really entertaining. Recycler. I don't believe that's actually his real name. But he does own a recycling, an auto recycling business. There he is, the luck box. The star child, the actor, the producer. It is Dylan Flashner, everybody. Dylan's game is is, um, is evolving, I will say, and I don't mean that in a in a in a bad way at all. You can you kind of when we watch players play on these games, week in and week out, we can kind of see them growing. Francisco over there in seat number nine. Take a look at how the players and what they're buying in for. Mariano has the table covered. Action Dan, Pepe, Brown Balla. All going with the mid five figures. Francisco and Recycler with the short buys. We're playing $25.50 with a $50 big blind ante. Once again, I'm David Tuckman. I want to thank you for spending your Wednesday evening here with us. As always, the players are talking. You won't hear much from me, but I see you all in the chat. What's up, Jimmy Bluffett? What's up, Steve? What's up, Jose? What's up, Christian? Hello, Al Curry. Kill Bluff. Thank you all for being here. Red glow is uh, yeah, it's a little, yeah. A it's lot a of people complain about that. The first time, yeah. That's interesting. <laughs> yeah. Check. It's a bit hard to tell the suits sometimes at first, but you get used to it. Is it perfect? 
Ninety-four. So four ninety-four. Four ninety-four. He'll still VPIP like twenty percent. <laughs> <laughs> you got a half million? Yeah. I don't think he's gonna buy in for all of it. That's for that's for the one, one day, uh, one day I want to be like Pepe. <laughs> buy big. <laughs> we all want to be like Pepe. Hundred shot on. I think he's the Started richest Washington man from Guatemala. Probably, yeah. Uh, this past week, and Pepe's a funny dude. Yeah. How much? He straddle? The slow rolls are insane, <laughs> and everyone's everyone like knows it's coming. I don't know if he even knows he's slow rolling. <laughs> like half the time, it seems accidental. Yeah, he accidentally slow rolled me pretty bad the other day. <laughs> yeah. Pepe? Yeah, he. Uh, it was boat over boat, <laughs> and like he had like the nuts, and I had the second nuts. Yeah. Yeah. He just he sounds was, about He right. was like slowly showing me. I'm like, okay, just just show me I lost. Like, you know, <laughs> you know what I mean? If you just expect it every time, then it doesn't hurt as bad. Well, you you know, like you do it playfully, where like you half the time uh, win, half the time lose. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, whereas like he's all the time winning. And like, <laughs> yeah. And then we totally flip That's for the true. time. Okay. Every, uh, yeah, he seems to never lose. Like yeah. Yeah, yeah, you, yeah. You can throw. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. You have strategy. And then sometimes, yeah. like, he's been running so in the middle so of the stream, we'll do like fifty dollars a person for the staff and stuff. Okay. Yeah. Eighteen. Eighteen. Uh, no. Okay. He's taught me lessons. Okay. But Don't listen. Not the good ones. Okay. The expensive ones. Oh. <laughs> Rambolo with top pair here. He's going to bet it. And why not? I'd bet it. The beautiful sounds of ruffling chips. There's something so, for me, that like the subtle sounds of chips is very meditative. Like maybe it's like birds nice. chirping for some people. <laughs> That's not as meditative. But the chips really get me going. I kind of like it. So this guy called 75,000 with eight jack, you told me? Oh, yeah. Uh, you're talking about the JRB eight, hand? Eight, yeah. Eight, 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 right? 10, yeah. <laughs> that was like that, one of the most crazy hands I've ever seen. Hand. I'll tell you guys his hand. So, the other guy had two tens, right? No, yeah, it's queens. So, so like JRB opened 3,000. I call sixes on the button with, I don't know, 50, 60,000. The small blind calls, the big blind makes it 25,000. JRB calls, and everyone else folds. It comes eight, seven, six. He bets 9,000, JRB calls. Turn is a four of clubs. There's a flush draw. Okay. He bets 25,000 or 27,000. 
Pepe. JRB calls. Consumer. The river is an eight. JC. He bets 75,000. JRB calls and. Hey, Pepe, how's it going? Pepe is here. Pepe, Pepe in the house. Calls, and he has queens and Jeremy has ace ten of clubs. <laughs> hey, Pepe, how you doing? Yeah, Long time yeah. don't see you. So, Long time ago. Oh, but, like, uh, the board came four to a straight. The eight yeah, paired. Yeah. He just bet 75,000. Like <laughs> Jeremy, Jeremy was like, I don't think you play over pair like this. And he calls that he has an over pair. He has an over pair, yeah. <laughs> That's how it always works, too. You, you think you got some hand. sick read or something like that. And then, boom. Yeah. Coming in for 100 then. How much? 50 to go right now. 25, 50, 50. Cool. Curtis was playing too. Oh, was he? Okay. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Cool. King high flop. Oh. Fours are good, but see if Pepe can actually get the showdown or not. There's a four. He's likely to get the showdown now, but Brown Ball has picked up a flush draw. Nine. Nine. You saw four. Oh, oh, that's Got two of them. <laughs> He's already ahead before the oh, turn. <laughs> Life's no good. You know, I have, I have like all these reds. <laughs> You're only set. <laughs> only set. I don't know, they were kind of Torellian back there, man. I didn't even know you had those. <laughs> okay. Good thing I didn't have a flush and Pepe's like, how much? <laughs> yeah, that that would have been awkward. <laughs> He's like, how much? Time? Christian Soto in the chat. What's up, my man? Soto's been doing a ton of commentary here at Hustle Casino Live. We are lucky to have him. Give Soto some love in the chat, everybody. What's up, Dave1970? Hello, Jose. Collado, less dead. Words will kill me someday. Me too, probably, buddy. Hickles, pickles. Use your one. Yeah, you're right. You would take What's up, Eric Peterson? Hello, everybody. Two, your three bet here from Recycler with the gap suited connector, 9 7. T1000 has got king, queen of clubs. He's going to call. Dylan in there as well. We'll see this one three ways. That's the Armenian mic move. Push the rack in. <laughs> Dylan's got the ace of hearts as we look at this two heart, two five board. Hey, Jeremy White, hello, my friend. I like Dylan floating here. Certainly could have played it as a raise as well with the ace of hearts in his hand. But decide just to float. And Dylan's going to bet $2,000 into a $2,400 pot. Oh, the recycler was one and done. He's out of there. Todos juegan menos el lugar. No me gusta. No he ido por lo mismo porque no me gusta. You hit the button, right? I'm the button. Yeah, no way. So excited about our million dollar buy-in game. That's May 28th, 29th, 31st. I'll definitely be here doing a lot of commentary. Hopefully Soto will be here as well. Maybe we can convince Bart Hansen to come out for it. I have no idea. But have you guys seen the lineup for that? Tom Dwan, 
Mariano. Tony G. Doug Polk. Jungle Man. Well, the list up for you later on in the show, but I'm telling you now, mark down your calendar. May 28th, 29th, 30th, and 31st. That is going to be amazing. Last time we had a million dollar game, we had the biggest hand in the history of live stream poker. $3.1 million. And I was lucky enough to call that. You think Tom Dwan would at least send me, like, you know, a nice bottle of whiskey, right? I got to talk to Tom about that one. Action there. Do us a favor, give us a thumbs up. We certainly appreciate it. It helps us. It helps us continue bringing you free poker content. If you guys like the show, help us. Okay? The more likes, the more YouTube promotes the show. And the more people watch the show, and it becomes that much easier for us to continue creating free content, free poker content for you guys to watch. Christian Soto says, Bart must come. I'll let him know that. I know Bart's coming out over the summer for a buddy's wedding. I know he's coming out in October. And I'm sure he's coming to Vegas for the World Series. I just don't know what his schedule like is uh, at the end of May. But we'll see if we can get him out there. Shaney says, I want to see Santos. Well, Santos will also be there. Kilbluff says, don't give Bart a choice. Just tell him to get his ass to Hustler. Okay, I'll let him know. He's a dad now, you know? I mean, it's hard. Lives all the way out in Massachusetts. Do us a favor when you watch the show, and that's any of our shows, by the way. All of our shows are on our YouTube channel. You can watch them whenever you want. Whenever you watch, give us a thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe. Tell your friends about it. If you don't have any friends, go make some friends. Then tell them. Tell your Uber driver about it. Pecos Pecos says 1K, 1,000 likes, get you a free drink. I don't know if it's free. I still got to pay for it, but I think Ryan Feldman would probably let me. I think if we get 500 likes, I get to keep my job. 1,000 likes, I get a drink. 2,000 likes, I get a second drink. 3,000 likes, I get like McAllen 18. Oh, see? It's a préstamo. It's a préstamo, la neta, it's a préstamo. It's so funny. Is it just four of you? No, it's uh, five of us, five of us. Yeah. Three kids, me. Oh, you got three kids. How old are they? 300. 17. Well, I have a 19-year-old, but she's in Chicago. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. I have a 17-year-old. T-1000 with ace-queen. Okay. Oh. Brown Ball uh, is the one with his time with fours. Good game in here, this game. I, I'm actually kind of excited about this lineup. Not the most talkative group, but I don't think we will be hungry for action. I think we'll get plenty of that. And some really good poker, too. You, 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 guys, you guys look like twins. <laughs> No, it's just the better look. What's up, Jenks? Yeah. Keep our man Jenks, the social worker, some love in the chat, everybody. Let me try No poker, no life, okay? What's up, HCL fam? No. No gamble, no win. Gamble, I win. 
Mariano, check. <laughs> check. You got a blind check there, 10 high flop. For those of you who get irritated when any of the commentators, myself included, ask for likes, understand that Four. it could be far more annoying <clears throat> if we just started charging for the stream, right? I mean, we want to make the stream free. We want to continue to have the stream free, no paywall, right? But we've got a, you know, a pretty big production team behind me. They need to get paid. These things, you know, they don't pay for themselves, and we don't want you to pay for them. Look at this, running sixes. How about that? Mariano misses the flush, but he hits running sixes. And I don't know if Pepe's going to go anywhere. I mean, all the draws missed pretty much. I mean, 7-8 got there, but Queen Jack missed. Jack 8 missed. Clubs missed, but... Fold or call? Fold. Okay. <laughs> Pepe is a believer, and he lets it go, and Mariano's kind of surprised. Good river, Mariano. But yeah, listen, guys, I, I honestly, for me, I don't really give a shit. I'm not going to lie. You are ace 10, right? And I, it's, it's way above my pay grade in terms of how the algorithm, all that stuff works. But I have been told the more likes you get, the more YouTube promotes the show, the more they promote the show, the more people watch the show, the better it is for the show. That's it. Okay? Yeah. I like that. Hey, yeah, Christian Soto knows what's up. Shout out to my man Jimmy Bluffett. What's up, Bluffett? How are you, my friend? What's up, Nut Floosh? It's me, David Tuckman. What a flop here. We got a little action flop. Brown baller with middle set. Mariano. Open ended with the overs. Backdoor flush. Possibilities going on here. King, no help whatsoever from Mariano. Spade would have made things really interesting. $9,700 in the pot. Brown ball, uh, gonna bet 3,000. Mariano get a pretty good price. I imagine he'll call this on uh, what is a no flush board. We've got a Padoogie board there, meaning four different suits. So. All the outs are clean for Mariano, and he gets one of them. Look at that, the seven of clubs on the river. He makes the straight. $15,700 in the pot. Brown ball has got 34.6 behind. Brown ball about 20,000. So he over bets the pot. He bets 20,000 in the 15-7. And Mariano is just doing a little bit of a dance, a happy dance inside. Oh, and he is gonna go all in. And Brown ball uh, <clears throat> hating life now because he knows he's probably beat, but it's 14,000 to win 70. He's getting such a good price. <laughs> yeah, I mean, give Brown Ball a credit for not like snap calling. 
Oh, yeah, I think you have to be about 20. I just don't see a, a world where you can fold this now. You're just getting too good a price. What a sick spot here. I mean, is Mariano ever doing this with a set of threes or a set of bluff? Fuck me. Maybe tens. <laughs> I feel like they just fold. Like 14 into like 5 bajillion. 14 into 5 bajillion. Not quite, but you get the point. Tough spot here for Brown Baller. Should have bet small, then I could fold. He bet 20 into 15. If he bet like 11 into 15 and gets jammed on, a little bit easier to make a hero fold. I just don't know if he can do it here. Is Getting Mariano five to one. Is saddle enough to block tens here? Probably not. That's such a good hand. Wow, what a lay down. That is an absolutely is phenomenal lay down by Brown Baller. <laughs> Could you do it? Mm -hmm. Getting five to one. You've got a set of eights. Could you make the lay down? Guatemala poker school. In Guatemala, casi no se practica el poker. No. Poquito, pero no. No, no más que México, México. Ya, ya hay más, ah. México es bastante. Yo te digo porque también he jugado mucho en México. Where? Oh, next level fold to that man right there. I mean, even more difficult because Mariano can bluff. Now, I don't know if he's bluffing in that particular spot very often. going to need that, that link. And I don't know if he's ever raising, like, I don't know if he's ever playing pocket threes that way, where he, like, just calls turn and then bombs river. <laughs> if you have a king, you have the best hand. Three. <laughs> <laughs> Working clown says it says it best. Insane fold. Anyway, you cut it. I mean, you're getting five to one. Yeah, you know you're gonna call and you're gonna see Jack Ten there a ton, but it's really hard to fold getting five to one when you've got a set of eights in that spot. Really impressive. Stephanie Ham saying never slow play a set. He didn't slow play it. Pot was built and he bet bet bet. He bet a little bit small on the turn. Bet three thousand. But obviously, you know, you don't know what your opponent has. There were no flush draws out there. And you don't want to lose your opponent either. Nick Airball in the chat, everybody. All the stars are coming out. Airball in the chat. Christian Soto in the chat. Jenks in the chat. Gotta love it. Nick Airball saying it best as well. Motherfucking brown baller. Thank you all for spending your Wednesday here with me. I'm David Tuckman. Hustle Casino Live, baby. Yeah, Street's pointing out, Tuck, when he says, Tuck, oddly enough, if Brown Ball that smaller on the river, it would actually be easier for Mariano to come up with the bluff jams when he overbets it's really hard for Mariano to bluff since it's polarized. Yeah, no, I agree with that. But at the end of the day, also, it's a matter of if Brown Ball, uh, when he bets 20, 
and he only has 14 left. He's getting five to one. If he bets, you know, if he only bets, say, 11, and he leaves himself with, like, 25 behind or 23 behind, He's just not getting quite as good a price yeah, like yeah, to make a hero like call. Poker there. Yeah, not too much, but I like. Either way, I really like the restaurant. Uh, a very interesting hand for sure. Absolutely, it's a fun city. But whenever I play poker, there it's. This is Strato. Action. Thank you, sir. Queens for Pepe, T1000 has got top pair. Is the seven deuce on? No. This time, no. Dylan Hardwick asking, uh, says, Tuck, you okay, no longer no on the Triton streams? Please. I no. actually, Thank strangely you. enough, I uh, got an offer to go to Jeju. No choice. Just a little while ago, but I could not. My uh, my schedule did not allow me to go to Korea for that long a period of time. So I'm looking forward. I mean, hopefully I'll be able to do another Triton stop sometime in 2024, if not maybe 2025. I do. I really love what Triton does. I think they put on a great show. Just a quality organization and a great production, obviously. So I was kind of gutted. I really wanted to go to Jeju, but I just couldn't make it happen, schedule-wise. <laughs> I think you might have it. I think it's too early, too soon to bluff, right? That's a good read by T1000. I don't know. You watch me? I, I don't know. It's so early. No gamble, no future. Wow, you call your win, buddy. Yeah, I'll go. guarantee. I'll guarantee, 100%. Huh? I have seven dudes. Yeah. <laughs> I have seven dudes. If he calls seven dudes, I have furniture. Yeah, it's really true. That's a Pepe special. Pepe loves to do that. He loves to say that after he has the goods. Mariano up a quick 27,500, but it could have been more. Brown Baller down 25,500. It could be worse. Saved his last 14 and change. No kicker. No kicker. Jack's good. Jack's good. Yeah, yeah. yeah cool, Sometimes you fold the best in. Yeah. Like this time. I bet a thousand you snap calls. Huh? <laughs> Some of the work. Yeah, I was lucky enough a few years ago to go to Montenegro with no, uh, with Triton. Yeah. Like I said, uh, just a, a class organization. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So confusing. Yeah, my next here, trip here. is uh, I will be in Barcelona in May. So next month, a little bit over a month from now, I'll be headed over to Barcelona for a poker tournament. Should be fun. Okay. <laughs> Shout out to my, name, my man Nick Airball, who's in the chat. We very recently did a ride podcast show that's available on YouTube. It's actually available pretty much everywhere. If you like to listen to podcasts, it's available wherever you uh, listen to podcasts. And uh, if you like watching them, you can head over to uh, YouTube. Really? Yeah, Eric, I, uh, Eric Peterson, I agree. Barcelona is one of my favorite cities in the world. It's beautiful. What do you mean they owe him 200? Like he lost, he lost 200 there? Yeah, this is money in the bank. He's going to come from money. Es que se los presté para que hagan el negocio, después me lo dan. Oh, ya. Sí, interés. Sí, interés. Soto, I'm going to have to get you on that, bud. You just play only three, four hands or one. Let me know when you want to be on. I want to get you on that. Maximum five hands. Really? You got your friend tell you when. Now, yeah. A couple months ago, I play a lot. Huh? Vitrega's oh, yeah. Eagle tuning in now from Barcelona. Well, uh, 
Thank you for staying up for us then. Air ball, by the way, if you're wondering why he's not here. He's saying in the chat that he's in Vegas for another week playing PLO every day. Playing a great game. I thought I was doing the, the cherry popping. Uh, trying to be nice here. Yeah. Pace the straddle. Get everyone take, on the take board. Some light. Yeah. Thank you, brother. <laughs> straddle. Three okay, straddle. so everyone has won a hand now. I think. Dylan? Okay. One hand. Right? Okay. One hand. Okay. If you're new to our show, by the way, we do this Monday through Friday. We record all of our shows, every single one available on YouTube. Just watch them whenever you want. Give us a thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe. The uh, the small little purple chips those are twenty five dollars. The white and red ones those are hundreds. The green and yellow ones are thousands. And kind of the red ones on top, right there on Mariano stack those are five Ks. No collection I was. Jesus in Denver. I'm going to Denver tomorrow, Jesus. Yeah. I fly to Denver tomorrow morning. They have tortilla soup? Yeah, this is good. good. Very hot, but it's very good. Okay. Very good. I love tortilla soup. Every place is different, but here. Yeah. Hey, my friend from uh, Barcelona, Ortega. Are you up late? Or uh, or you just are you an early bird and you are you are up early actually? Are you playing? Mm -hmm. Mariano. A lot of people in Denver. Like it. Full house here for Mariano. Dylan. Drawing dead, but he's open ended. See if he puts any money in while drawing dead. I think he might. I mean, I, I, you've got sixes. Hard to think that you don't have the best hand right now, and if you don't have the best hand, you've got to draw. Now, little does Dylan know his draw is no good, a six is no good. Small pot, though. Oh man, what a river, what a run out here. What a run out for Mariano. I mean, he hits the seven versus a set of eights to get paid. And here he's got a full house against the straight. That's a very dirty river. That is a really dirty river. I mean, it could have been worse. It could have been a six, but still uh, nearly impossible for you to get away from that one. Yeah. Dare I say you probably shouldn't get away from that one. Just pay him off and move on. He got better on the turn. A little better, yeah. Nice thing. Thank you. Hey, I only have one rule when it comes to the chat, guys. What? What? Because we really want to let you guys have a good time. Oh. Just don't be a dick. Huh. Santosh in the chat. What's up, Santosh? Santos, by the way, will be here for the million dollar buy in game. Give that man some love. Right, Jimmy? It's a simple rule. Have a good time. Treat people kindly. But just basically, just don't be a dick. Life's too short. Oh, is that the wrong Santosh? My bad. Flush draw here for Brown Baller. Pair of eights for Dylan. Thank you, Albert. Appreciate the love. You hear my voice, but there is a, uh, a big production team behind me that 
puts in the hours upon hours upon hours, and they really uh, are the ones that should get all the credit. Mariano. Oh no. Okay. Sniper, you know. <laughs> Seven four off suit. <laughs> Three hundred, bro. Come on. <laughs> Jenks pointing out hours upon hours. Yeah, our production team works so hard. It's one of the reasons why when we, when, whenever, if we're up for an award or anything like that, I'm always just pushing hard because I know, I know how many hours, I know how hard our team works. Mariano, seven four. Ace high flop. T1000 and Pepe both had the aces. Mariano with a pair of nines. Forget, give me the. Uh, I, I was watching the video. <laughs> you do, you do so, so fast, strong. Race from Dylan with Queen six out of the hijack. Francisco just calls the oh. button. Looks like we are uh, adding a player. Drum roll, who's it gonna be? Okay. That guy. Fancy, poshy, backpack guy who fist bumps and brings lots of money. 
More on that guy in a bit. Mariano open ended, paired board. If any money goes in the pot, kind of feel like the hand is probably over, but we'll see. Action Dan, you can follow him on X at Action Dan Poker. Ace high flop. This time it's dealing with ace queen. I remember 1980, first time I came to the United States. They take me to the downtown LA, 7 and Broadway to watch a movie. And we will watch a movie and and they say, what do people, some people, you can stay wherever, how many times you want, right? Watch it free. I said, what the hell, free? I said, I watched it three times in the movie. <laughs> she goes, what's free? <laughs> I, I never see it. Thank you for the Free? Yeah. yeah. I watched the same movie three times. I know. <laughs> 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 yeah, but, yeah but free, I never see it. Yeah, when I first moved to this country, I couldn't believe that Amazon leaves the boxes right in front of your door. No security, no nothing. Wow. I was like, what? These people are crazy. <laughs> oh, yeah? In Argentina, you, you know, you drop, yeah. you drop 25 cents, it's gone. Like, <laughs> you know? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Here you could get like a TV delivery. I, I think just, the same. Yeah. yeah. When, I, when I they drop them from a hole. Yeah. What? <laughs> what? Yeah. But there are some people here who still packages. They call them torch. It's such a funny turn. Ace three, buddy. You know. My six is good, bro. <laughs> you gotta be fucked up to steal people's mail. You don't even know what it is. One of my friends' parents. 
parents, their boxes were getting stolen and they got like a camera and they like recorded the guy and the police like found him. Oh good. After or something. That'll be yeah. a real scumbag. This is in like the Bay Area. Yeah. 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 Like almost always it's shit you don't even want. Damn, yeah, they so probably just try to resell it or something. That, right. Last yeah. time I played. Oh, before COVID, yes, yes. You, you got your hair, you look totally different. I look the same, I just used to wear a lot more hats. Oh, yeah. <laughs> How you been? Very good. You don't seem to age. <laughs> he doesn't. Poker keeps you young. It's the chickens. <laughs> Francisco, my, my sister got some chickens, oh, yeah? and she she made me scrambled eggs with their eggs. It was the best scrambled eggs yeah. I ever had. Oh, yeah? Amazing. Yeah. Makes me never want to go back to... A lot of spades out there, and Flash has got it. Thousand? Yeah. Mariana going to bump it up with King 5 suited. A little club variety. Good game so far. Not a ton of table talk. So if you get bored of my voice, I apologize. Ace 8 6. Good flop for Mariano in the sense that he can represent this. And more importantly, brown ball is missed. Did not put really any more money in the pot. I'm kind of surprised. T1000's got Ace 10 Recycler with the Kings. Did you make any good movies lately? Not making any good movies? <laughs> that, that, that might be a stretch, but I've been making movies, yeah. 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 <laughs> um, I just filmed one like two weeks ago out here, and then I filmed in uh, early January. Yeah, so. Sounds like they don't make like before, right? Something like the movie, movie area goes zero down. Yeah, well, it's just so over done and saturated. Now, like, it's hard to make a movie that no one's seen. You know what I mean? That's the problem. Yeah, you gotta do, like, the shots that go, like, Tarantino or something. And even then, sometimes it, like, just comes off as so unrealistic. Yeah. Or, like, you know, it's just... When I watched, in. um... So a four bet here from T1000. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And Recycling now moves all in. You hear T1000, I'm pretty sure I just heard him say, whoops. I was like, what the fuck was that? No, I, now he's got to figure out how much more is it. Is he getting priced in the calling this? I mean, I know he kind of did a similar, like, crazy ending with 
Django and Hateful Eight and stuff. But it's so out there. It's like so out there, but I didn't know. On top of like, I'm a novice. I don't know what I'm yeah. talking about. No, I, but I from mean, my perspective, it, it felt a little weird in that movie. Much, yeah, it felt 3, weird that one felt weird too. Yeah. Like you're not the only one. T1000 is gonna gamble. No, he does make the call. I've, I've talked to people about that. Twice, twice, yeah. twice. Felt twice, weird. twice They're gonna run it twice. Twice. Twice in terms. T1000 looking for clubs, diamonds, or an ace. I read the book. There you go. Easy game. Yeah, it's good. It's like a sci-fi. The three show. chops it. It was a, it was a book, and then it. A would have won it. A, but uh, T one thousand is going to win the first run. Yeah. Wow. <clears throat> oh, wait a second. Oh. Any ace, any five would have been, uh, would have been good for T one thousand. But instead, they do chop it up. I finish the show in two days. Oh, really? Yeah. yeah. I really like I like that stuff. I, the books are very good too. I read them like years ago. Yeah. Have you seen the show Severance? I've, I've seen TV? like an episode Oh yeah, or Severance two. is great. That's it's like one of my really, favorites. really interesting. Yeah. 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 It's by uh, Ben Stiller, right? He's like one of the producers. Yeah, you're right. I watched uh, that. Um, I think it's just one season right now, right? Yeah, yeah. The yeah. second one like, got Thank delayed you. a bunch. And I think uh, it's going to come out in 2025. Or that something. was like one of the most Always. unique. Yeah. Like, I always remember that show. It really stuck with me because it was so different. Yeah, yeah that was a really good one. Yeah. Lauren stepping out. I mean, Magic stepping in. Like Online tournament fees can add up quickly. Breaking news. Every tournament is rake-free for the month of April on WPT Global. Huh. Where? On WPT Global. Why? We are crazy. Sign up by clicking the link in the description and play tournaments with no fees at WPT Global. Use bonus code YT53 and we will match your first deposit dollar for dollar. No rake. No fees. Unbelievable. Just unbelievable. It's unbelievable yet believe it. YT53 and uh, get in there. April, no rake for tournaments. The month of April. Pretty sweet. Thank you, Dave. Appreciate you. All right, let's go. Three way. This is for collection. Oh. Come on. Who's not there? Yeah. Check. Not much going on for either player. Mariano's ace high is good. Not much in the pot either, though. Dylan's going to bet 1,200. Try to target an ace high type hand, the king high type hand, the fold. 1,200 into 1,800. So Mariano getting two and a half to one to make this call. Dylan usually gets credit for this kind of spot, but Mariano is definitely intrigued. And look at that, what a call for Mariano. Ah. Mariano, that's a professional move, but that's Mariano's a pro, bro. Come on, bro. You never can make that move, Pepe. Next time, no vengo la otra vez. Mariano's a pro. Pobrecito, Pepe. Pepe is not full. <laughs> Me too, even. Same. I'm not full. Two 
200 cattle. Come on, dude, I don't know. Dylan, I'm just so used to trying to give you money. I was just about to say, I thought I could get you off of that. But like, I did No, for sure. 100%. Good stuff. Thank you. Good bet. That was a close one. Yeah, tough one. Make it 1,300. Thank you. I'm making more, you fool. Oh, yeah, it looks that was like, like a, a perfect it just, amount. It was either a bluff or a bluff. Yeah, no, that was a good amount. You should make plenty more. Yeah. Okay. Okay. No, I just get more suspicious. Yeah. I was about oh, to say, okay. I thought it was a little, well, because there was only about like nine or two thousand in the pot, so oh, okay, okay. like a pot that's right, right. probably worth it. Okay. Yeah, that's Get a bet here from Brown Ball uh, to thirteen hundred dollars. Wow, what a turn card here, Pepe, with a gut shot hits it. Bink, Check. that was easy. Action Dan doesn't have much. Shouldn't really get himself in trouble unless he wants to Check. go crazy. But Pepe has got the goods, and now Brown Ball is going to decide if his king queen is good or not. Heads up action here. $12,000 in the pot. Brown ball up. Checking. How much he? 4300. Sweet. Good. Brown Ball does make the call of $4,300. Get one of our bigger pots of the night. Just over $20,000 headed over to that man right there, Pepe. Courtesy of that spiked straight. Beautiful little jack on the turn for him. Thank you, Pepe. Maybe it was good, River. Yeah, I was about to say. Maybe, Maybe he had nine of hearts. Yeah. Maybe he had nine. Maybe he had <laughs> two pairs. For me, who house no good, bro? Bad River. <laughs> Come on, Mariano. <laughs> Seven four. Come on, bro. No matter what can say, come on, dude. Ken? No matter what can they say something. I like oh, Charles. Charles. Come on, dude. Come on, dude. Because when they say, they get all the way to the end. Come on, dude. Come on, dude. Come on, dude. Six. Make it six hundo. Make it six hundo. Seventeen. 1700. Six. Six hundred. Recyclers reaching for chips. He's got a gut shot. He's got a heart. See what Brown Baller wants to do on. He's going to raise Recyclers all in. Recyclers have that much money, so it makes it a little bit easier. They're going to run it twice. Recycler needs a queen or a heart. Decisions are easy when your opponent doesn't have that much money, right? I mean, it's just, okay, let's just get it in. Brown ball wins both run outs for the set of kings. 
takes down an $11,000 pot, and Recycler has been felted. Make it 300. Make it 300. Hundo. Mariano lets it go. <laughs> Paired board. I'm late, I'm late Doesn't want to get involved. No. Yeah. Radio? Yeah. I mean. Yeah, I got you. I got you. Mm. Dylan, you should get Pepe in the movie. Hey, I, I kind of want to like include like ¿Cómo se dice el villano de la de la de la poker en inglés? El qué? Villano del poker, el malo del poker. Oh, the villain of poker. Said he wants to be like the the villain. The villain. Yeah. I love that. I mean, bro. All right. Give idea the name. Yeah. The guy from the jungle. Uh, that this could be. <sighs> Wednesday night poker here at Hustle Casino Live. Four bet from Ashton Dan. <laughs> the pot was too close to me. Unintentional. My 200 or the next no, 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 round, no, I'll stop like it. it. I like it. I like okay, it. I love you. Yeah, I love you. Okay, I'm going to get it. Yeah. 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 $500. $500. Magic announces. $1,800. 
Me salíaste. Nice. Yeah. Now I can see what Mariana had. It's necessary evil. <laughs> it's so far. Action Dan bets twelve hundred dollars on a pair of fives. <laughs> one pair with for uh, two one thousand. Do you have left? Alpha, alpha. I think the headset is sticky. Yeah, yeah alpha, alpha, exactly. That was a bluff. That was a sick bluff. Bump it up. <laughs> Thirty-seven hundred. Pot's been bloated here with a bet and a raise. Jack of Diamonds in a turn doesn't change anything. Check. All right, check, check. King of Diamonds on the river. Not going to change much. Neither player with much of anything, but the pot is quite significant, as you can see. Action Dan with a check mark, which indicates it's his hand if it goes to showdown. Well, his pot, I should say. We are playing $25.50 to $50 big blind ante. I'm David Tuckman. Check. Who is it? Check, check. Both players with enough showdown to show it down, and uh, T1000 is going to see the bad news. Pretty big pot, considering what these players had. Francisco enjoying a little bit of a meal. Go here at Hustler is actually quite good. No lie. All right, two. All right, the two is on this one, copy. Two on the shadow. Thank you, Jim. Mariano bet $500 into $21.25. Oh, Ten high. Ten high? Yes. T1000 with the uh, 69. We're not playing that game, though. Yeah. Not today. Mariano's got nines. Unlikely to flop a set. With one of the nines dead. But he's going to bump it up. Make it. 
Ten hundred. Ooh, and Pepe's got kings. Mariano makes the call out of uh, in position. Top set from our for Pepe. Bad news for Mariano, but could be worse. I mean, just really unlikely to lose any money in this spot. Eight. Eight hundred. <laughs> Check phrase, buddy. Heads up action here, ace nine versus ace three. There's a three. Check. Bet, 600. Chop it up on a paired board. We continue about an hour and a half into our five-hour show. As I mentioned, all of our shows available on our YouTube channel at your leisure. And nobody is talking at this table, huh? Whenever I say that and I start to engage the chat, they start telling the story. It never fails. Wait one hand or buy? Uh, it's like Hawthorne. Do you know it's steady? It's like 15 minutes down <laughs> Hawthorne. Do I owe any? Oh, OK. So then you're by here. Yeah. OK. Cool. I, no, I don't think though. so. We we'll usually go to the berries in, in Venice. Yeah. I'll try to wake up earlier. We're gonna go work out tomorrow. Yeah. Who will? We're gonna go work out tomorrow. Oh, nice. Oh, yeah. oh, Dylan picks up Ace King earlier. suited. I usually go at like one. But um, I mean, that might work. I don't have to be here until 3.30. Yeah. yeah. One will be, it would probably be better if we go around 12. Give you more time. Yeah. Right here. 600. I have a pasta. Yes, an extra six jumbo. Yes. That's it, and uh, one coke. Yes, I'm really liking that hat. I'm digging that Star Child hat. It's pretty sweet. Did she cook the vodka? Yeah. We're good, right? We got it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you. Oh. 
Amity, five o'clock half hour. <laughs> Make it two ah. yards. Make it seven large. You have made? No, I didn't name it yet. This is my favorite color. Like green. Like green. The green is money money color. The blue is gut gut color. The red is money color. So I have a hard protect for everything. Yeah. My friend, give it to me. All you can eat. Nope. Pablo. Pablo the third one. Pablo? Why Pablo? This looks like a Pablo. Pablo? Yeah. Which Pablo? Huh? <laughs> the, the one you used to play here? No, I'm just saying your turtle doesn't have a name yet. No. I think it should be named Pablo. It looks like it's Four. Okay. Do you see it? Okay. The turtle looks like a Pablo, right? I can, no. I can see a Pablo. Like a, a, a 400 channel. Kind of, kind of like 400 a channel. No, I want to call. Or is it a girl? 400. I want to call. Rafa. Rafa. No! <laughs> I like that too. That's a good phrase. Rafa. Three. 10 hundred. Rafita. <laughs> Lucky. Lucky? No. That's a dog's name. No, but it's still lucky. Alright. You're gonna give me lucky. My third lucky. This time when you ask me for my third one, don't ask for it. It's lucky. Okay. <sighs> you want to fold one and call one? <laughs> <laughs> I like my hand, bro. Pepe makes the call. Says he likes his hand. Why not? Oh. Pepe doesn't like it so much anymore. No hearts out there. No aces out there. No sevens out there. Brown Ballo with nothing, but he's going to take a shot at it. Is he playing the uh, the Queen Deuce in honor of Israeli Ron? I don't know if that's true or not, but Bluffy? we'll run with it. No. No? Take it. <laughs> <laughs> pair is good. No, no pair, no pair. Brown Bella blocked you. I love bluffing. Brown Bella. It usually doesn't Brown work Bella. though. Fuck. <laughs> I know a Brown Bella. Come on, boo. <laughs> Where's Charles? That was too I'm long. stuck the most. I, I bought my right to bluff. Where you from? Watching Nickerbox. He's watching Nickerbox? <laughs> He's babysitting? Yeah. That's your friend. Yeah. We're at it. Nice little hand for T1000. It's going to make it $300 with the suited connector. What's up, Dana Craven? How are you? Check. Not much table talk. If you have any questions for me, shoot away. I don't like to talk over the table, but if they're not going to talk, well, somebody's got it, right? Grace. What's up, Lakers and One Nation? Desde que empezaste hasta ahorita, ¿no? Ha mejorado mucho más. Antes jugaba más el campo. ¿Ya? 
Three bet here for Mariano on the button. Both Pepe and T1000 are going to call, so we'll see a three way. Nine high flop, must be nice. Absolutely dominated with Queen Nine, and you hit the nine. there for Pepe to stick around with, but you see, he is stubborn sometimes. Maybe looking for a club, looking for uh, some sort of straightening card, but the six of spades does not oblige any of that. You know all too well about the all even. Did you check? Pepe, you check or no? No, I check already. You check, right? Yeah, check too. Pay attention on the hand, Maju, please. Check, check. $10,000 in the pot, blank on the river. Not really all that worried about a five at this point. I think Mariano can bet this for value. No, wow, that's that's a pretty tight laid out check back. I mean, yeah, Pepe's gonna have tens there occasionally, but when he has a nine, I think he's gonna have a worse nine than you. 10-9, jack nine, nine eight. I think maybe you can get a little bit of value, but Pepe did fold a 10 earlier on, so that might be in Mariano's head, thinking, hey, I'm not gonna get val I'm not gonna get thin value for my for my opponent in this spot. Kings are cheap. King, king, three, two spades out there. Nobody's got much of anything. T1000 now open ended. Really, certainly looks like uh, if T1000 were to breathe on this pot, he could win it. There you go. That qualifies as a breathe or a breath or a wisp of air in any way you look at it. T1000 with his tatted right arm collecting those chips, stacking them up. Action Dan on his left. 
That's perfect for a turtle. Pretty young. Yeah, yeah definitely. Got Magic and Lauren in the box tonight dealing. I'm David Tuckman. I want to thank you all for being here. You gave me a chance today, okay? About an hour and a half into our huh? five hour show. You show. a chance today, okay? Okay. <laughs> yeah. The bottom pair. Okay, okay, okay. Thank you. King high flop. Pepe's got king queen. Recycler's got pocket threes, a set of threes here. This one could be expensive for Pepe. Recycler's only got, well, can't be that expensive because Recycler only has $3,500. But all the money's going in. And Pepe is drawing dead. Oh, all right. <laughs> Twice, Twice. Kings. Twice. Kings. You can run it 95 Twice. times. You got kings? No, king. Uh, king yeah. high. Yeah. And you're drawing dead. Full double up there for Recycler, who's down to 10,300. Remember, he bought in for eight, so he's up a couple of thousand. 2,450. Thank you, unless he rebought. I guess he might have rebought, though, right? I think he did, actually, now that I'm thinking about it. My hand, my hand. Look at those chips getting recycled. Not yet, not yet. <laughs> Thank you. Let's have a little more time. You know, for, you know, for some reason, I play better when I lose in the beginning. I don't know Got a couple of questions in the chat about the WSOP. Um, I've talked to a couple of people over at the World Series of Poker, and it looks like I am going to be commentating the World Series of Poker again this summer. But I don't know when or how many events I'll be doing. Especially for a longer session. That has not been finalized, but I'll probably know sometime in the next month. But I'm pretty excited. And, and frankly, I, I feel really honored. It'll be, uh, I think, my 14th year covering the World Series of Poker. Yeah, it's my 14th year covering the World Series of Poker in Las Vegas. And uh, in 2010 and 2009, I actually worked on the World Series of Poker Europe as well. So come on, dude. Check. It's been a good run. Check. Check. Hmm. Check. Check. Fucking three. Check. Check. Thank you, Dana. I appreciate that. Again, I don't know how many events I'll be covering. It uh, it won't be like the old days where we covered like you know 37 events in 41 days type thing. Where I would go early on back in you know 2012, 2013, 2014, you'd go to the World Series. I would go to the World Series of Poker like I would go on May 30th, and I was basically there until mid July. I'd come home for a couple of days here, a couple of days there. My family would visit me, I a, but I basically uh, was in sense? Vegas for six weeks straight. And that is not the case anymore. They just don't cover as many events anymore. Jimmy Bluffett says it'll be my 19th year playing the World Series Poker. There you go. Appreciating car. Rich Rifkin says Norman Chad has commentated the World Series Poker for 45 years. He's still hoping to say something profound. Unlikely. Go. Yeah. Fifty. Fifty. Fair enough. <laughs> Penny Blanco says Norman Chad is the only person who can entertain us by commentating. About players attire at the table. Yeah, Norman Chad. Listen, I, Norman and I go way back. 
He's a thorn in my side at all times. But uh, he's one of those friends that you just, uh, you're happy to have around. Brown ball is jacks are very good here. What's up, Mango ha Havoc? Good luck. Thank you, everyone. Thank you. Most poker players don't like rake, and that's why we're throwing you a party. During the month of April on WPT Global, there's no tournament rake. That's right, play tournaments at WPT Global and enjoy more money in the prize pool. There's zero catch. No tournament rake. Use the promo code YT54 and get your deposit matched dollar for dollar up to $1,200. This is a joke. This is a guy have a motorcycle. He drives so fast and he get an accident and, and he lose his two balls, no balls. And they get operations and the doctor said, what would you do? WPT Global, no rake in April on their tournaments. Pretty sweet deal. Use the code YT54 and get a massively generous matching bonus over at WPT Global. Let's see what happens. And then they, they, they didn't tell him what, what's going on. After a little while, after two years, they call him to say, what's going on? How's your life? So my life's perfect. I get married and I get two kids. You had two kids? Yeah. That's all. What's the name? <laughs> Pinocchio and Robocop. <laughs> <laughs> that was good, I like that. that was Check. <laughs> Pinocchio and Robocop. Seven. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, Francisco. Right, they're good, they're good. I like those jokes. He's got at least one for stream. Man. You know what? If you can't laugh, you can't enjoy life. You gotta laugh. <laughs> you really do. I like that motto. Got yep. Gotta laugh. Laughing is a good oh, thing. Yeah. I agree. Thank you. If someone gives you their car parts because, like, a family member died in a fiery wreck, you just gotta laugh. You gotta laugh. That's all, pretty much. That's all there is to it. Yeah. That was that was fairly dark. Shadow right? once again. It's because he uh he takes like I don't know if you know what he does. No, right? no, I, I okay. yeah. yeah. yeah you know. <laughs> I'm no, it's still I'm a shit, the, I'm the it's still a shit joke. I just yeah, want no, you to no, understand no, no, the no, shit no, joke. I appreciate you explaining <laughs> your shit. <laughs> He goes everywhere with his rooster. And he wanted to get in the movies. And the sister, you cannot get in the movie. rooster. Yeah. So he went outside and put the rooster under his, his pants. With his, his pants. Shirt, yeah. Inside his pants. And he opened the zipper. <laughs> and then he get in, he sit down. Three strong. In the middle of the movie, the, the rooster pull up his head to watch the movie. And there's a girl near there, growing his and her boyfriend, and says, tell her boyfriend, hey, this is a rooster right here. Because the rooster was looking. Yeah, so what? You leave it alone. Say, hey, this is a rooster here. Yeah, leave it alone. Yeah, yeah but he is my popcorn. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. This guy and uh, we were have dinner on the boat, and he told uh, joke. Yeah. yeah. But this fucking routine is my fuck popcorn. <laughs> Pepe three betting, thirty-two hundred action. Dan with king nine, gonna play it. Thank you, Steve from Chicago. Appreciate that, man. Yeah, it was pretty amazing. For those of you who are. Uh, interested in anything that I do, you can always follow me on X. I'm at Tuck on Sports. I'm also on Instagram 
I talk on sports as well. Instagram is basically just like my family stuff, though. Family and dogs. I had some exciting news happen for uh, my own family. I coached my kids' hockey team. We won the Southern California Championships in the U10 division and went up to the States in San Jose, which is Northern California. And they won, my kids' team won the state championships, which is pretty exciting. Action Dan, look at Pepe. I mean, this is a weird play by Pepe. It's just... Thanks. Bluff, value bet, blocker bet. But if it's a blocker bet, it's a really big blocker bet. Nonetheless, though, Action Dan wins a huge pot, $29,000 with King Nine. And Pepe now down $9,900. Brown Balla down $37,000. Mariano, Action Dan are two big winners so far. Let's just take a look at our leaderboard. Oh, for those of you who don't know, it's uh, ice hockey. Call. Okay, you give me banana and orange. <laughs> Samuel Ullman says, can we bet on the under 11 hockey next year, or uh, why are you telling us? Good. You know what, Samuel, you're right. Uh, what you do on your own, you feel free to bet Anyone? with your own, you know, your own personal bookie. I don't see why you can't. I mean, I feel like in today's world, you can pretty much bet on anything, can't you? You find somebody to take your action. Pepe wins a small one after losing a big one. Big pot there with pocket tens on a king high flop. Yes, Lakers and One Nation. We do have ice rinks in California and hockey. Actually, the game in the game of hockey actually kind of exploded in California when Wayne Gretzky came here. Uh, Wayne Gretzky was Saturday, traded here many, many, many years ago by the Edmonton Oilers to the Los Angeles Kings, and with that, hockey has never been the same. Besides playing cards, um, yeah, I think the Venice Beach and. And then comedy store. All good, Samuel. Yeah. I knew where you were going, man. Yeah. Raise here from T1000 with the Queen Jack. Uh, I have a buddy coming tomorrow from New York. He's gonna. We're gonna play the 102040. You ever try Santa Monica Pier? It's nice too. Yeah, Pier. We're going to Venice, you will see Santa Monica Pier. Alright, really close. Usually, like when you go to Venice. Nice lob here for a uh, recycler and uh, certainly an interesting turn. Francisco had top pair, but that's no good anymore. Recycler with the flush draw, now with a pair of queens. Pepe's got a pair of threes. Recycler bet. Pepe calls. Pepe, a little stubborn now. Maybe a little bit on tilt, huh? Lost that big pot with tens, and uh, he has been hemorrhaging a little bit. Flush. Wow. Five of hearts certainly bailing him out. But he does not win a very big pot. Recycler not betting for value there. Smartly checking that one back, and Pepe is going to rack those chips up. I tell you, nothing gets you 
off tilt faster than just winning a couple of hands, right? Like it's like the fires start to get, the fires start to build up yeah. inside you. You, you right? feel like you might punt off, and Pepe certainly kicked below it. We've seen him do it before. Do but then you win a couple of hands and you feel better about life. Wrists. <laughs> yeah, I should do it more. If you have shoulder pain, you should just. Hang. Hyper Rippo says he has a pair of not flush draw tilt. No, no, I'm not pointing out that he's, he shouldn't have continued on. I'm just pointing out that he could have been tilting. We've seen Pepe do that. Sarasota, Florida. Sarasota. Okay. But I moved to Austin three years ago. Oh, that's cool. Texas, yeah. I love Austin. Same. Yeah, we've seen sometimes, you know, with, with Pepe, there's a few players in this game, of course, but Pepe is one of those that certainly is an emotional player. He lets emotion sometimes rule his decision making. Now, in that particular spot, obviously, certainly warranted. He's not going anywhere. He's got a pair, he's got a flush draw, the nut flush draw at that. Um, but that said, I think. I was wondering if he missed if something had happened, right? Bluff. If he had missed, would he bluff at it? And I'm not sure the bluff would have worked. Out. Rolling. Oh, Francisco with Queens, Action Jack, Action Dan with Jacks. They run it once, one time. Action, uh, Action Dan's suits are not good. And he is drawing very thin. How about a 10 for a sweat? No, nope. that's it. I got it. Francisco does indeed have it. Queens full. And the pro with a full double up. Sketches, movies, shows. Um, mostly movies at the moment, independent movies is the big thing for me. Um, that's cool. Yeah, it's, it's pretty fun. I got into comedy uh, like two years ago. Oh, okay. Doing some, that's, like, open that's, mics. that's a tough arena. Like, I have oh, yeah. a lot of respect for comedians. Like, that's a tough one. We get You're extra takes and all you that. Do it. I give it. Oh, shit, sure, I didn't know that. Eat, eat, 50. I get up there and eat shit. <laughs> <laughs> So Texas has a good scene though, right? Tons of open mics. So you're gonna perform here? I'm just gonna go check it out. I'm just checking it out. Okay. Yeah. I came here. Uh, this is a poker trip. Okay. So we got comedians, we got actors. T1000, by the way, not the only comedian to play poker, play at a high level. Clayton Fletcher. I affectionately call him Fletch. Out of uh, he's out of New York. He plays a lot of. Uh, he plays mostly tournaments. He no, also hosts a I podcast. Every time. I do one. It's called The Tournament Edge. Or the, I think it's the, called The uh, Tournament Edge. I've been on it. Content machine, but he's had a couple yeah, of really, yeah, really, really deep runs in the main event. Great. They're here, I think. Yeah, they're out here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're, they're awesome. Shuttle and a reshuttle. Oh. I'm the boss. Yes, that's correct. I'm going to They should be able to parlay that into some bigger stuff. Oh, I agree. Yeah, I think they will too. Yeah. It's only a matter of time for that. No, no, no. Welcome to the school. Yeah, yeah. Cool. Thank you. Thank you. 
Jack high flop here. Dylan bets fives. Does not hit a five. He is unlikely to win this hand. And he gives up. Yes. Yeah, some uh, Adam Johnson also getting some love. Adam Johnson out of the uh, KC area originally. Plays a lot of poker, also a really funny dude. TV two times pointing out Adam Johnson, also very good in the booth. Yeah, Adam's a good dude. I want to thank you all for being here. Listen, we are only 70 likes away from my first drink. Come on, let's make it happen. I want to crack open a beer. What's up, MWJ? MWG, pardon me. Jim O'Brage. Little Virgil. Appreciate your support, everybody. Sarah Grodick. Excited to see T1000 in the game. Oh, we're at 1,000 likes, so good news. 500 likes, I keep my job. 1,000 likes, I get a beer. So I got a beer coming. We get to 2,000 likes, I get a second beer. We get to 3,000 likes, I get a McAllen. Let's make it happen. Thank you all. Appreciate you guys. Very quiet game. Not quiet in the sense of action, but quiet in the sense of just literal talking. With, uh... Oh, God. Dave Kaplan. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And he's, uh... He's, I think he's gonna do a movie. Is he really? Yeah. I think he's planning on doing a movie. That's cool. About his story. How did that come about? Oh. Uh, he has friends in Austin. Oh, okay. Yeah. Eight? Eight hundred. But he, yeah, he's kind of like a an idol for me. Oh, for sure. He does it all, comedy, poker, he's, acting. Yeah, it's incredible how he can do it all. Yeah. Is it? Francisco's king queen survives. And I imagine this will go check check, but we'll see. If 
Francisco turns his hand over, and he's going to take the pot. I was thinking you were going to block there. Yeah? I was thinking about it. I, I was, that's why I checked. I was 100% sure you were going to come with it. All in. <laughs> you know what? I already made my mind. I'm going to call you. I already put it in my mind. You need me 500? Yes. Thank you. Shuttle once again. No, oh, sorry. Brown Bella teach me how to play poker. <laughs> He's a teacher. Did he pay you? Huh? You pay him or he pay you? I pay him. Oh, okay. He teach me. Bad deal. <laughs> I Bad teach deal. you. But for me, worse. If I taught you, you would be the world's worst student. <laughs> <laughs> the first thing I would teach you is stop limping. <laughs> <laughs> Francisco right. just notably no. not aggressive pre-flop. Oh, yeah. He's very happy to see Maybe flops now, right. for as cheap as he can. <laughs> Three. Four. Donation. Brown Baller knows he's behind. He's going to make the call anyway. Thank you for your cooperation. <laughs> Donations accepted? Yeah. Yeah, donation center open today. Yeah. Okay. But at least I give thanks. Some people don't even give thanks, right? Yeah, for true. their donations. Yeah, that's true. Very generous of you. When people say donation, that means he had barely stupid pair. Yeah. Yeah, I did. I had eight. <laughs> What's going on for either player? $3,500 in the pot.
Actually, I guess we're both in Orange County, but like opposite yeah. ends. So on Tuesdays we play here Check, check. Action Dan's, Dan's going to win it. Well, oh, hold on a second. Looks like Action Dan might bet. But either way, he's going to win it. Sean, who crushed it on the cruise? This crypto guy, who was Yo's friend, his name was Killian, and uh... Yo Viral's friend? Yeah, and uh... So, uh I haven't looked. Can I do 100? Yeah, yeah. Oh, I thought I was the... 100. I thought you were the 100. I don't believe you. 300? <laughs> there was another guy that crushed. That's fair. I'm trying to remember <laughs> who it was. I mean, really Curtis, Curtis was up a lot the day I lost a lot. I like Curtis. Yeah, he won like 250 the day I lost 230. But I'm not sure how he did because I, there was one day I took off and I think he lost that day. Four days? Five days, six days. You went on the WD. Yeah, five days, six days. Was, yeah. Did you do it again? Yeah, it was fun. It looked fun. Yeah. I think I might do it next year. I think it's too many days. Maybe it could be like four days extra for me. Yeah, it was a bit long. Berkey got dusted. I think he lost like 400. Big Tarn current card here for Mariano. Still behind yeah, the pair of sixes, but if Action Dan makes two pair, could get really juicy. Instead, it's the Ace of Spades in the river. Does Mariano want to try to rep? Robbie play? Rob? Yeah. You say he win a little bit, right? No, no. I think he lost the most. Huh? Yeah. Yeah. 18. But JRB wins, right? JRB won, yeah. A little bit. Yeah. He ran hot. What was JRB doing on there? <laughs> running a game. Out? He was running a game. He was <laughs> chilling? He was running the game. Huh? And I he just walking. never would expect him to go to something yeah. like that. Yeah. <sighs> How's the rooms and everything? Did everyone have the same rooms or was there like suites? No, there's like people who and... People who wailed out? Yeah, I wailed out. I oh, spent nice. like 10K on one of the suites. But oh my God. It wasn't even <laughs> that nice. It was Jesus just like Christ. slightly larger. You have balcony or left out? Yeah, we have balcony. That's how you know Sean's yeah. been on a heater. 10, 10K for a I mean, cruise room. Whatever, it's vacation. <laughs> yeah. Splurge a bit. Yeah. I don't know. You went with your girl? Yeah. Did she play too? No. Nice. She just she just hung out. Yeah. I'm surprised cool. Rampage didn't play with you guys. Yeah, I mean, he didn't have a seat. He I played know. the I mean, he 5K have. two times. They, he played the 25k, the 10k. A lot of people didn't get a seat. Like, most of the days when we played, we were like five handed or six handed most of the time. But, yeah. He ran like a 20 by 50 game the last day. And yeah. Apparently, there was drama with Curtis. Like, he was like scamming them or something. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Like, I only know what Rampage told Berkey. 
Well, now's the time to talk about it. <laughs> on the internet, <laughs> now's no. the time to talk I about mean, it. I think I thought that they already <laughs> tweeted something about it because Ricky said that. Uh, yeah, go ahead, man. Everybody's listening. Go ahead. From Bally's or something. I don't know. It was some, some, oh, shit. I mean, what I heard was that, like, he did a card flip and he, like, marked the cards and looked for an ace. Oh, 21 did, like, card flip. Yeah, exactly. That's what they were saying. It was oh something like God. that. That's what they were saying. <laughs> I don't know. And then they did, like, a, I, I heard then after they did, like, a coin flip and... Like he lost, and then he was like, "Oh, the flip was like rigged, or the coin was like I he, he refused to true. pay, or something like that." I, yeah, I don't know. It's so weird because like we were gambling with like like yeah like we were gambling with like 100, 200 k like the day before, and then he just what like oh, Curtis apparently. I mean, I don't know. I just heard what from other people like he like he told me. Superman. Yeah, I mean he was there, I guess. He lost 30? Actually, damn it, a pair of nines here. Yeah, I, I lost 40 or something like that. So who won? <laughs> <laughs> uh, one of the guys, yeah. No, no, I know. I was, yeah. I was kidding. I mean, in the cash game, I'm trying to remember who won. I mean, it's hard to know because every day was different. Yeah, right. Like, right? Like, we played for like six or Louis is crushing. Look at that. that Louis cashing out for like eight hundred thousand dollars. Yeah. That's a lot. Yeah. That's for everyone else. Thirty-one hundred dollars in the pot. The and then the psychler does not hit that miracle two outer. Yeah, it was just that game. The last day I went to Rampage game and said... Yeah, the 20 by 50. Can you put him in the list, Rampage? <laughs> and he was joking. He said, no, no problem. The table. <laughs> and the guy wasn't there. And he said, yeah, you're the first in the list. Yeah. And then I, I walked out and the guy followed me. Who are you? They're scared about you. I said, no, he went to the front. Yeah, I went oh, there. Okay. Yeah. We took a taxi back after. Yeah, so we take to the airport. <laughs> Dude, in, the, in the last day. Yeah. Yeah. And then, but I, I, I went to the line where you can get your money and say, they're going to stop the game like 11.30. They said, fuck, we're going to spend three hours to get your money back. Yeah, well. Yeah. So, no. How was the... I got lucky they did it for me. They sent someone to go get my money for me from my oh, account. Because nice. <laughs> I was playing the cash game. How was <laughs> the, the tables and dealers and everything? Just normal? Yeah, normal. Did the uh, shit move so much that chips were falling no, off? No, it doesn't oh, move. You don't it feel it. It's like so big, like you barely feel it. Well, I've been on a cruise ship before yeah, yeah, a few yeah. times, and yeah. most of the time it's fine, but sometimes yeah. there's sway, you know? Yeah. No, this time, this one is very good. Very nice weather? Very yeah, Usually nice. you okay. can't. The dinners are not that good. Okay. Yeah, they're not. You know what? We had the best ones for the cash This game. happened in the tournament. Some of them were not very good, yeah. Cost me my tournament. I have a lot of chips. Yeah. And... Me and the guy, I have ace five diamonds. Yeah. And there's two diamonds there, and the guy was betting, betting, and I call him on the club. He bet big, and I say, I hope, I hope the, I hope uh, diamonds come right on the turn. Mm -hmm. You know what happened? The dealer, this, he bet. I called the the lady number one. He was thinking if he called, no. The dealer sleep and fold the three cards on top. <laughs> and four, it's, so the deck fell. It's, it's a 10, 6, 4 diamonds. The 10 is a hard, the burning. She was sleeping, waiting for that lady, and she slipped and fold the three top cards. And the, the 10 was, and then called the floorman and said, okay, you burn the 10, and the other tag pick it up and mix. Oh, motherfucker. Two diamonds coming. I'm going to make the next flash. Yeah, right. I'm going to double all my ships. And, and those they, are burned. Once, once they're flipped over, they're burned. No, they only the one, the ten. Oh, so yeah. they expose the next. And one. They, they they put the other two cards to put in, and then right. next. But and then they give come six of hearts and the turn. Fuck, this guy have a big hand, and then he bet, and you know what? I was thinking, see, I put him all in, I block him. Yeah. And he falls, almost caught, but he right. falls. But yeah. I was blocking because I was so mad about that. Yeah, I know. I would not want my shit. I'd, I'd be pretty angry too. Yeah, she was like this and sleep, and the cars fall, the three cars. That's crazy. Never seen that in my life. And I told the floorman, you should, 
you know, she, she, the car flipped because she, she was sleeping. Yeah. She said, well, nothing we can do. Hey, send her to sleep. It's so bad. Where do I have to Mariano deciding what he wants to do here. Earlier on, it was Brown Ballo who made a really big lay down against Mariano, and they both had huge hands. Mariano had the nuts. This time, Mariano can beat all the bluffs, but he can't beat a value hand. Can he find the fold here? Brown Ballo bet 10,000 into 12, 4, 7, 5. So Mariano getting a little bit more than 2 to 1 to make this call. Failed pizza delivery boy in the tank on this one. $10,000, that's a lot of pizzas to deliver. And he does let it go. Took him a while to find the right answer, but he does eventually find the right answer and lets that one go. I expect more people on the WPT cruise. I expect more people. Yeah. It's like there was like 2,000. Action something. Dan, four betting. Action right? Dan living to his <laughs> name. <laughs> Interestingly enough, Action Dan, not the first Action Dan. The first Action Dan is Dan Harrington, who won the World Series of Poker main event back in 1995. Is that right? Did I get my date right? <laughs> We gotta go way back. So 95 when he won. And then he made a final table again. But Dan Harrington, ironically, was called Action Dan Harrington. Yeah, 95. Okay, thank you, Al Curry, Jimmy Bell. But I thought it was 95. And then he made the final table again. 17. Like eight, nine years later. Mariano bets, gets called. Benny Blanco says action Dan Harrington, yeah, one in ninety-five, and then final table in two thousand three and two thousand and four. Another tough spot here for Mariano, but this time he's got the goods. Yeah. 
And he goes, check, check, and Mariano's gonna win about a $21,000 pot. Yeah, Harrington on poker was one of the original books that was actually quite helpful back then. Lauren stepping out, Magic stepping in. Maybe 75. Wow. What's good? So everyone on the ship is a poker player, pretty much. Yes. Uh, or like a girl. No, no, no. Yeah. A lot of them, but not everyone. No, like 90%. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, yeah, a lot. Yeah, maybe like 80 or 90%. Yeah. That's interesting. Apparently, they hired girls to come to like, yes. some of the events. <laughs> like, they hired a Like, Jean? Jean was there? Just to play events? Or no, no, no. Not just like. Have you ever wanted to advertise on the number one poker show in the world, Hustler Casino Live? Hustler Casino Live has 1.5 million unique viewers per month. HCL also has 1.4 million watched live hours per month. Our viewers are 95% male, and 72% of them are between 25 and 50 years old, with an annual income over six figures, and they are very engaged. Our viewers are your customers. Let's build your brand and do some business. To learn more, visit us at hustlercasinolive.com slash sales. They 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 eight hundred. Would be five hundred. It was fifteen hundred total. Yeah, that's really cool. Yeah, so that like means everywhere was a little more than that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, all the restaurants. It right? was like no sweat. Cool. Nice. They got they got yeah. seated and so. Yeah, I might go next time. Sounds yeah, it was fun. Sounds interesting. I thought it was fun. Did you Check. have to get invited or like anyone can go? No, anyone can go. Oh, okay. You just have to like pay for your room. Yeah, you just have to get your room. Uh, they gave away a lot of free rooms too. Oh, cool. Yeah. 1500 I probably could have got a free room if I didn't want like a nice one. That's sweet. Yeah. I mean, it wasn't even, it wasn't that big or anything. It was just, I mean, the bathroom was nice. Yeah. The bedroom area came with like a, a free bar, like a, a bar of like 10 bottles, and we didn't even drink any of it. Oh, no. <laughs> Because when we were drinking, we were always out. And we yeah. forgot to take it from the room. But, I mean, whatever. Yeah. It was fun. Colin. Colin. Cold. Dan, you got like 225? Keep saying <laughs> you, bro. <laughs> That's three in a row. Our collection. Thank our you, collection you. payer today. Uh, 225. That's fine. You gave me props. Talking about the cruise. I'll tell you, uh, if you're a uh, poker fan, which obviously you are since you're here, I imagine, and you followed it on Twitter or Instagram, no the stories were amazing. When did he leave? <laughs> like 30 minutes ago. I, just, I, 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 I didn't notice. I just asked Louie. I was like, where did he go? <laughs> 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 so annoying. Yeah. 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 He lost one party, Rich quit. I'm sure he's in Baca right now. That was not cool. That is not cool, dude. Yeah. Cause he's he's kicked my ass like a lot of times, and I just stay. I stay every time. Yeah. About halfway through our show tonight. Yeah. Scheduled five hours. I'm gonna step out for just a minute. Be back with uh, leave you guys with some table talk, hopefully. It was right here, was yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Like loses one frustrating pot and he bails, you know. Seven? Seven Yeah. Fucking lame. <laughs> really? He's, he's, he brought five hundred. He brings five hundred k. Every time he buys it for one hundred k. He loses five thousand and leaves. <laughs> yeah. I don't think he's finished one session. Pretty funny. It's not cool. 
1400. He did the show. He said he had a family emergency, but soon they're eating french fries. Sorry. No. Are you feeling buyer with one hand? Uh, I'll go. Yeah. 300? Three hundred shadow. Chamomile tea? 3,000. Tea. Green tea? Yeah. Yeah, little. Mm. Francisco? 3,000. Tea to the carrot or fruit? You can choose. <laughs> Oh, you 
I walk back in the booth and I see this very sexy bluff from Francisco. Man, betting 12-1 into about 19. And Action Dan now suddenly can only beat a bluff. Francisco putting on a master class, I like it. Queens versus tens. And Francisco is putting the queens to the test on this ace-king high board. See if Action Dan can somehow snip this one out. No, look at that. What a fold. The fold and the bluff from Francisco, and he shows the tens. Oh, nice play by Francisco. I mean, tough spot for Action Dan. I didn't see how the how the how it played out and how we got there, but you're staring at an ace king flop and you got queens. It's tough. Francisco just plays tight, plays tight, plays tight, and wakes up and is like, oh, all in. That's the way you. That's the way you teach me. That's the way. Run, Bella. Anyone? <laughs> yeah, she's grabbing the tea and she's coming. You are watching Hustler Casino Live, brought to you by High Stakes Poker Productions. I'm David Tuckman. Till it flashed there, Mariano, Brown Paul, Francisco. All here. Pepe has stepped out. Yeah, Jeremy White, he shows it too. I mean, it's one thing to bluff, but then the show. Give Francisco credit. He knew exactly where he was at. I'm going to have to watch that hand back. It's the one that's great about the show. If you ever miss a hand, if you miss a night, you can always go back and watch it. King on the turn. Still fives in the lead. I want to thank all of you for spending your Wednesday evening here with us. If you haven't yet subscribed, make sure you do. Check, check. CT1000 representing the Lodge. I got to make my, day, wait, my way down there. I talked to Doug about that. And at some point, I will get my ass to Austin. Yeah. MWG says, nothing beats watching it live. I agree. Listen, I'd rather watch it live, but, you know, we do a show Monday through Friday. I'm going to go on a limb and say that once in a while, you might have something else going on on a random Tuesday or a Friday. And if you miss a good show, or you step out for a second, you go to the bathroom, you got to come back, you miss a good hand, the nice thing is that all these shows are recorded. Who is down the most? I believe it's Brown Bala. He flopped the set of eights. Mariano had a straight draw. And on the river, he hit the straight. Brown Bala did well to save himself his last $14,000. But really an unavoidable spot. Just sometimes it's, uh, that's a poker, queen, not much you can do. A queen 10 or something. Oh. Cool. Oh, nice call by T1000. An action Dan. Hemorrhaging chip suddenly. Yeah. Gets bluffed and then gets caught bluffing. Oh, yeah? T1000. Like a Terminator. Well, I was thinking of raising. Do you like Sarasota? 
Yeah, it's my home. That's where I was born. I was born, born and raised. Nice. Yeah, I spent I love some time it there. in Tampa. Okay, I moved. I moved there for the last two years before I moved to Texas. Action, Dan, getting a little bit cold. Figured, you know what? I'm gonna put my sweatshirt on. I'm gonna heat up that way. Two hundred. Did you ever venture out to Ybor City? <laughs> I see the smile already. So I already Dylan's got nines. Action Dan has the queen <laughs> ten that T1000 was worried about. Every weekend we drive up there and rave, rage, yeah. rave yeah. at the, uh, what was it called? Sort of like a Mardi Gras, like every weekend. Amphitheater. Yeah. Amphitheater. Yeah. The, the, spinning, oh, the spinning dance I floor. Hell yeah, you know, spinning uh, dance floor. You guys know Saddlebrook? Mariana's yeah. gonna three bet here with King yeah. Five yeah. suited. Yeah. I don't think Dylan's gonna go anywhere, not with nine. Really? Okay, yeah, I played that. Yeah, that away, Dylan. Stick it right in his eye. Beautiful there. This is a play Dylan definitely would not have made a month or two ago. His game has evolved. And he knows that Mariano is capable of three betting light. Really stupid, but I went. Trying to and uh, Mariano just not getting a good enough price. I, I mean, if he knew he had 42% equity, he certainly would make the call, but it's hard for him to know that. Things can run extremely uh, fast. Yeah. Six and I realized it. Uh, I had to run sideways, my friend okay. said. He said, run sideways. So I started doing this. But that was an interesting experience. Did he, catch too. he follow you? He followed me. Oh, yeah. He jumped. So they run fast for a short time. They're very quick. How about the but you? they can't go this way. Oh. They can't turn, so if you ever get chased by an alligator, which you probably won't, you're not going to throw something in its face. You do like figure eight? I was, yeah. How old was you? I was 15. If he catch you, that's it. And then, uh... What are you saying, Jared? If you outrun an alligator, you, you go sideways? You always yeah. run this way. Okay. Never run straight. It, it's very fast. Well, it they can run up to like probably, I don't know, 20, 30 miles an hour. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Well, I run faster than that. <laughs> I call. Okay, I think so we got a prop bet. I bet you that like Mariano cannot I, run I mean, uh, they can't, 30 miles they an hour. Can't turn their body as quick. Okay. So that's why you did. I've also uh, <laughs> I've done cow tipping. Oh, maybe. You know, <laughs> that was an interesting one. Tip a cow over. Unfortunately, that sounds fun. Of the alligator or the cow? Alligator. No, I got this. I lost like 200. <laughs> yeah, I mean when it when it turned pretty fast, I didn't realize it can I didn't realize it can turn that fast. Three ways. It was definitely a shocker. If you fall or something, check. You will be hit long. Check to Yeah. <laughs> yeah, if I mean it's it was dangerous. Not a great experience. Four hundo. That was kind of scary, man. Yeah. I've done some really yeah. I've done some things that I shouldn't be here right now. Oh, yeah. Really? Yeah. For what it's worth, I call the cow tipping thing things, bullshit. Yeah. Why As somebody who grew up in upstate New York. Many times. But, yeah, remember last week? Cow tipping is pretty like, much a myth. Do you remember that? It is incredibly, incredibly difficult to tip a cow. the freeway, and you were like, YOLO. I'm just like, whatever. Yeah. So give me some of that. And you were like, nothing like, cracked, mixed well together. <laughs> yeah. I didn't even ask him. The guy's signature blend. <laughs> but hey, who am I to ruin a good story? I don't know how Jared's still here with us. He really shouldn't be. I think I have more than nine lives. <laughs> Cow really? tipping, really? Yeah, that was a fun one. Is it like tractor tipping? I actually did it with uh, Jennifer Capriotti's brother. It's no tennis. She was a prodigy back in the day. Oh, I forgot you were super into uh, tennis. Yeah, that was, that was my thing. Yeah. Murat, I am, uh, originally, I was actually, uh, I was born in Queens, of all places, but I spent some of my younger formative years uh, just outside Utica in a town called Clinton, very small town. Mariana with trip Queens on this Queen Queen 9, two diamond board, Brown Bala with a gut shot straight flush draw. Hello. It's not the first time these two have tangled and we'll see how this one goes. Trip Queens with the ace kicker 
1400. Versus the gut shot straight flush draw, and Brown Ball is going to raise right away. Brown Ball with $35,000 behind. Mariano's got him covered. Mariano, one of our big winners tonight, does make the call. Got to imagine Recycler gets out of the way now. And he does. And we got a heads up between the big draw and Trip Queens. M Brown Balla hits a 10. Not the card he wanted. Check. And now he checks. Brown Bola makes all sorts of pairs, but does not hit what he wants. And you just wonder, is there any way he can rep? No, he's not going to try. I thought maybe does he try to rep the jack. 4,400, small little pot. This one could have gotten a lot bigger. No doubt about it. Mariano going to go for a little bit, of, little bit of value here. Figures Brown Balda would have bet if he had a jack. And Brown Balda is going to pay him off. No, he raises. Oh. The raise from Brown Balda. Now Mariano's got to decide what to do. He's facing a $13,700 bet. Pot has just got under $25,000 in it. Once again, the action. Mariano bet. Brown ball, a check raised. Went check, check on the turn. And then it went check, bet, check, raise, and fold. Brown ball. -a. What a play. Probably weren't gonna make another hero fold, were you? <laughs> Probably not. <laughs> Mariano still up 30,000. Brown Ball is still down 27-2. But he has certainly, uh, he's played quite well. I mean, it could be a lot worse for him. Misses a big draw, somehow figures out a way to win the hand. Action Dan, living to his name, our most active player tonight. That was a fun one. That was a really fun one. Dylan has flopped the world. He's already got the nuts, and he's got a redraw to the straight flush. Unfortunately for him, going to be difficult to get paid. So Action Dan bets 5,800. Dylan makes the call. Okay. See if Action Dan wants to fire again. He is drawing dead. Uh, Action Dan is going to bet again another 800. 
So Dylan wants to just call one more time. If he knew what his opponent had, he would just check, call the flop, check, call the turn, and then check, raise the river. Oh, wow. And Action Dan actually hits a jack. I think this might go check, bet, check, raise. Yeah. Oh, Dylan is playing the hand perfectly. He has played this hand to absolute perfection. And Action Dan was bluffing, but it's like now he's probably thinking, well, I got the best hand. I'm going to go for value here. And he does. Wow. Action Dan actually moved all in, I believe. I think he bet 15,000 there. So our stats are not correct. We're going to sort this out because they are counting. It looked like he put three red chips in there, which would be 15,000, which has Dylan covered. They're going to count it out. And when it's all said and done, Dylan is going to win a monster pot. Just an absolutely perfectly played hand by Dylan Flashner. I don't know. Lucky. Okay, once again, the graphics were wrong. Action Dan actually bet 15000 on the river. He bet enough to put Dylan Flashner all in. And Dylan didn't waste any time calling. Yeah, again, so the stats are wrong. Dylan does not have 14,700 in front of him. He has significantly more than that. And I imagine that will get rectified sometime in the future. And now Dylan's got ace-king. So got a ton of money in front of him. And we'll see how this one plays out. Action Dan, by the way, was up earlier on. That is not the case anymore. No, I, because I drink coffee, I need to eat a cake. <laughs> so, you drink coffee, you need to eat a cake. I'm on diet right now. I only eat two cakes a day. Two only cakes a day is a lot. Cakes. You should you should eat four. <laughs> four okay. cakes Now I'm going to cut a half. <laughs> what kind of cake do you like with your coffee? Carrot cake. Carrot cake. The carrot cake, cake. Is carrot cake. Peanut good. butter cake. Peanut butter cake? Never even heard of that. Yeah, yeah, no. I've never heard of <laughs> Nobody home. When you knock the door, nobody home? Nobody home. Nothing else. Do you ever get tired of getting three bet? <laughs> Don't listen to him. I thought that was the first three bet of the day. I'm, I'm pretty sure that was the first three bet of the day. Check. In action, Dan, once again. Living to his name, and once again, going to be walking into it. T-1000 has got it. See if T-1000 takes a page out of Dylan's book and just calls, calls, and calls. Oh, and there's the ace. Got to be kidding me. 
It's like almost just set up hands for Action Dan to lose money. This is uh, awful if you're Action Dan or you're a fan of Action Dan. Goes from bluffing with Ace Queen to now he's got a hand. Now T1000 is a little bit deeper. So the thought process, does he want to raise? Does he want to build a pot up? Or does he just call? T1000, by the way, has also picked up a spade draw to go along with trip eights, but. I got close last year. I got fourth in one of them. Yeah, this is just a cold deck for Action Dan. And T1000 going to call 10-5 in the pot. River irrelevant. The tip leader had top top pair. I had top pair, and I went all in on the turn, and he had a better kicker. Anyway. <laughs> yeah, perfect check. Like Look at this. Came like 10, 5, 10, I imagine Action Dan will bet again, and then the check raise. Yeah. And I was like, maybe he just has over cards. <laughs> Especially if that's what poker two has got to be like. Oh, it was four. It was four. It was. Then I got four, so it was like four-handed. Yeah. Looks like about eight thousand, maybe nine. That. <clears throat> I don't know. 9,500. 9,500. T1000 obviously never folding. Just a question of does he want to raise now? And if the raise comes, can Action Dan find the fold? Those are my best shots, yeah. I just have to crowdsource the buy-ins. <laughs> and call up all my friends be like, do you want to take 5K? Do you want to take 5K? I'm going to sell, to sell like 200. Another 250. That's smart. Yeah. 50k is still a pretty big shot. Yeah, I mean, it's like yeah. 20%. Yeah, yeah. Why, why do you want the breath of that? I don't know. Why not? <laughs> it's, it's cool. Another perfectly played yeah, hand. Yeah, yeah, buddy. This time it's T1000 doing it. Yeah. So when the WSOP tournament, you That's the thing. Yeah. That'd be a big one for me. I mean, the only hand you're really worried about here is pocket aces, maybe pocket tens, but... All in? Yeah, there's the all in. Players, all you can eat. When C-1000 doesn't get snapped, he loves it. Love and life. I feel like going crazy in tournaments works better. Kenny? <laughs> yeah. You can, you can lose your head in cash if you like. Yeah. Magic. Just uh, dealing some pain out to Action Dan. 22,725. And he's going to get a count there. 22,725. 22,725 is the call. Pot is 52,000. Action Dan's just got to decide, does T-1000 have any bluffs? Say Jack-9, nine, 9-7. Nine, does he have any bluffs in here? Six. There wouldn't be a point in me asking if you show up on fold, right? You seem pretty stoic right now. Oh, Just hate to 
to fold, so. Cool. Tens, eights, good. He makes the call. Biggest part of the night, $75,000. And back-to-back uh, -back hands. Action Dan has just uh, dealt the pain, and he is reloading. Huge pot for T-1000. Just a brutal back-to-back. -back. I mean, the last hand, Dylan Flashner did a great job kind of selling the weakness. And when Dan backs into a jack on the river, he was bluffing the whole way. I don't think he was going to keep firing. But he backs into a jack. Every reason to think he has the best hand. Tried to make it look like a bluff by kind of overbetting it. But Flashner's got the nuts. And then this spot. Back to back like that, hitting the ace on the turn in a three bet pot. Just a very difficult hand to get away from. You got to feel for Action Dan right now. The last hour or so has been very unkind to Action Dan. Remember, it was Francisco who bluffed him. He had tens Check. on an ace-king high board. Yep. And Action Dan folded the queens, and Francisco showed him. Check. Then the very next hand, not a big pot, but against T-1000, Action Dan tried to bluff. Check. And T-1000 called him down with fives. And then obviously the last two hands we just saw. It has been a, a rough go as of late. YZ says, no one is talking. Why is everyone so serious? That happens sometimes after a couple of big pots. That's mine. <laughs> Everybody's kind of afraid to say a joke. It almost feels like a funeral for a moment or two. Stuck down. <laughs> 400 cradle. Uh, How much he? 34 hundo. Interesting flop here, 10,400 in the pot. Francisco's got queens and the queen of clubs. Brown ball's got a set of fives. All in? All you can eat. Wow, and Francisco just moved all in. Oh. Brown ball makes the call. You fly? Set. Okay. Twice? One time. Okay, okay. One time. once. And Francisco yeah, says aces? one dime. No, queen. $66,000. Oh, okay. Brown ball is a two to one favorite. Good luck. <laughs> it's like a flip. It's, it's like a not flip. a flip. Brown ball is a two to one favorite yeah, it's here. It's like uh, 13 ounce or something, or 11 ounce. 
Three. Many ounces you want. I know. Club. <laughs> club. Dusso club. Dusso club. Four of clubs. Four of clubs would be no good Four for him. Dusso club. Four of clubs. It is the Deuce of Clubs, and Francisco wins a monster pot. Just have Deuce of Clubs. 65-8. Brown Bala has flopped two sets and lost two monster pots with him. Oh, my God. Francisco, stop hacking. Brown Bala, I'm a pro, man. And then I said Deuce of Clubs. I couldn't believe it. <laughs> that happened like a few times. One time I called, <clears throat> the guy have aces high kings. I that's said, poker. King, king or heart, yeah, the king of cards. Can we get it? That's poker. That's poker. <laughs> Francisco, that's poker. That's poker. <laughs> 27,000. And you know it's never coming on the turn. <laughs> that would still give you hope. Yeah. Yeah, they had to give you a blank on the turn. Yeah. So if they come to the turn, there's still hope, right? Yeah, right. It's so sick. No, but the most important I call the right. I guess card. board could have paired. Uh, board could have paired. Oh, board's never. Well, you paired. did call the right. It never pairs in that. Four, card. four of clubs. That's I, what I needed. I, I couldn't believe out of all the cards you said, deuce of clubs. <laughs> that's that's that's. That's something now. I gotta really protect my chips now. Francisco, super pro. <laughs> no, no, it's what, it's, you know what happened when you run like, good, you run, you run good. good. You, you can be very good with the set right there. When you call me, I know I'm done. <laughs> it's just, Take it wow. But you weren't done. You had to do some clubs. That's okay. I was ready to say that poker, but you, you the one had to say. <laughs> I'll add 30. I'll add 30. Yeah, I agree, Christian. Bala took that really well. Just, uh, just, just one moment of, okay, you can stop talking now, Francisco. You protect your shit, man. See oh, that was a After that call, <laughs> after that call, I'm gonna start asking for the cards, <laughs> and I'm all in. Yeah, you, you never. Why does it work know when what? you do it? When I did it against Dan, I lose. <laughs> in, po in poker, I learned something. I flushed out all in fifty thousand. I lost both. Forty, forty, forty. <laughs> yeah, same thing almost. How much? <laughs> In poker, well, I learned something. Never lose your faith. <laughs> Brown Ball's got ace king. Maybe you can get a little bit back here from Francisco. He's got ace queen. <laughs> Brown Ball has reloaded, so he's got 40K behind. Francisco has him covered. Ace high flop could make things interesting. Instead, we get a king high flop. Right, you know? <laughs> Teaching us a lesson. They, I think. They Hello. I think they should make video because I called the right car, right? No, because I win. I because think that's gonna go on every stream of poker. <laughs> You'll get your video, Francis. Yeah. Don't worry about it. Uh -huh. they'll, they'll, they'll make a video about you. And we're all witnesses yeah. to this miracle. The, the calling of the dude. He cards literally said two arms. Yeah, that's, that's sixty-six. That. I think it should be. The hand of the year. <laughs> no, not the hand of the year, but the call of the year. The call of the year. Francisco, it's because you ran bad in all the big pots, and now you're now you're going back to back to even. Like against Bill, when you had aces and he oh. had tens, you ran bad, and now you're taking out your your. You good know luck what? On me. I don't remember that hand. You don't remember that hand? <laughs> <laughs> Only over a half million dollar hand. Yeah. <laughs> I was thinking somebody had king, king of club or ace of club. I don't want to take chances. That's why I went. <laughs> but if I had ace of clubs, I'll call you too. <laughs> if I had ace of clubs, you would have lost. <laughs> yeah, but I don't think you have aces because you don't you don't race with flop. Oh yeah, I didn't have yeah no aces. That what? I could have like ace jack with the ace of club. That's that why I put if you have ace of club or king of club. Yeah. 
Oh, yeah, I have a vodka. Yeah. Thank you. T1000 being a little aggressive here, four betting with Queen Jack suited. Back over to Dylan. So I guess the total numbers were correct. I thought he had more chips than that. I stand corrected. Ace five. See what T1000 wants to do here. He was the pre-flop aggressor. Dylan can call this one time. He beats a lot of bluffs. Beats Broadway combinations. He's going to call one time. Now this is where it becomes a little bit difficult for T1000. Because T1000 knows that Dylan would... Dylan would call here with ace king, ace queen, ace jack, those kind of hands. Now T1000 blocks queens and jacks. But if he bets again, he's kind of telling the story that he's got a big ace and he's gonna check. See if Dylan wants to put a little bit of money out there. Or possibly check it back. And he checks it back and see if T1000 takes that as a chance to bluff at it. Yeah. You gonna enjoy that? Yeah, we've been doing business together for 20 years. Oh. So he owns a glass business. So if you ever need windshields or any glass in your car, he's in so he comes to my yard and he buys all my glass. Yeah, T1000 is going to go for it. No, he's way above his And this is really going to put Dylan in a tough spot. Because a lot of Dylan, a lot of T1000's bluffs would have had a king. The board just strongly favors T1000's four betting range. <laughs> you in the scrap business? Yeah. Yeah, it, well, uh, the recycling business. So I buy, buy salvage cars from the insurance auction and then yeah. I sell parts. Yeah. Yeah. I wish I knew how you play. Oh, I don't know yeah. how you play. It's been a 20 years yeah. for me, over 20 years going there. Third generation. So. Tens, nines, good call. That's different level. Yeah, T1000 knew exactly where he was at. Dylan, that's different Just could level. not get Can Dylan get to level fold. Level. What a call there from Dylan Flashner. Dylan out to $25,000. Great, great call. Yeah. Really a great call. Tough spot, especially on the King River. Even if you don't think your opponent's got the ace, I mean, I, I think T1000 could actually bet that with King Queen. Uh, I mean, he had Queen Jack suited. Could just as easily have had King Queen, King Jack, something like that. See, I don't even think it's really figured out when you think it's really nice call. <laughs> there's always it's not enough or there's something different. It's like we're just biding our time by doing what we're doing.
Last hour of poker has been really fantastic. It's been uh, it's been an up and down night. I mean, the poker has been mostly good, but the last hour has been especially good. Dealing with a pair of jacks is the best of it. T1000 with tens. Round ball are going to go for it. T1000 lets it go. And what does Dylan do? Dylan has been making all the right moves today. Trying to figure this one out. It looks like he's going to call this too. And he does. Another pot for Dylan Flashner. Yeah, it's a five. <laughs> yeah, good teacher. I've been, I've been watching some tape back. Oh, from Mike X? <laughs> watching a lot of Mike X videos, a lot of action dance. Yeah. <laughs> Flashner's on fire. when you call, you win. You win. I didn't expect that. That's really funny. I find myself saying that in my sleep. <laughs> One can only hope for that, that well, saying right there. You win. You win. Created a monster down there. Yeah. Whom you create, Dylan, yeah. you cannot stop him. Huh? He's on a rocket ship. Dylan's always been a monster. Oh, and Dylan is feeling it, and he's picking up the hands now as well. A raise from Action Dan, a three bet from Dylan, back over to Action Dan. He's going to make the call. How about an ace deuce five flop? Instead, we get an eight high flop, two spades out there. A pair of fours for Action Dan. And I don't imagine that he's going to just check fold. Or actually, he's in position, so I don't imagine he's going to fold this no matter what. Not now. And he does make the call. A lot of interesting turn cards. That's one of them. Wow. What a turn card that is. Action Dan with a pair of fours. Open-ended with the flush draw. Dylan's got aces. I got lucky and then he got lucky. Dylan, a two-to-one favorite with one card to come. Two pairs, no good for Action Dan. He can win this with a diamond, a six, or a four, or one of the last two aces. Action Dan bets 3,500. Imagine Dylan will call. And he does make the call. 8,500 now turns into 12,000. The river's the ace of spades. Oh, my. Wow. And Dylan makes a set at the exact time he does not want to make one. And Action Dan has got it. Now, front door spades got there. So maybe you're worried about that. I don't think you're really concerned about a three too often, although we can see Action Dan has a three. But spades are certainly a hand that would be in Action Dan's range. And Dan goes 11,000. 
I don't know if I can fold this. I'm not that good. Oh, straight. All that, Dylan's on a rocket. Dylan's on fire. Dylan's in fuego. Dylan can't lose. Dylan's a pro. They jinxed him. Because Dylan just nice. lost a $34,000 pot. Nice. What a sick river. Flashner just left shaking his head. I, I, I don't know if there's much he can do about that one. Maybe he folds a different spade. Folding a set there, incredibly difficult. In this game, having a set is no good. We have seen that man right there, Brown Baller, lose two big pots of the set. And then Flashner just lost a monster pot with a set. Set's no good here. We might have to change Dylan's name to Action Dylan. He is just involved in almost every single pot right now. I think he's played more hands in the last hour than he's played on some Six. nights entirely. Great call. I think Dylan is realizing a lot of people just like to bluff on this game, so if I just call a lot, I'll probably win. You on tilt or something, dude? I'm, I'm like getting hands kind of and like getting fucked in the process too, so I don't know. Definitely a roller coaster, huh? Yeah, it's been a roller coaster yeah. for sure. Yeah. <laughs> the last like 30 minutes has been quite the roller You've been in every hand. Yeah. I think I've been in every hand. Yeah. yeah. And I sat out the first like hour too. So. Wow. Dylan folded, everybody. Call the presses. Dylan has folded. I think it's on Dan. I, I, I bet you. Uh, I'm so sorry. sorry. It's okay. <laughs> I thought you were considering it. What's the hundred for? Stuff. Just for my stack. That's what. We, that's what. I was just saying. for your stack? Yeah, I just needed a little stimulus. <laughs> you haven't won a pot in a while. Hundred stimulus, you know. Can I get five thousand for my stack? <laughs> <laughs> no, it goes to, to all the people working production. Okay. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. 
Brian doesn't pay him, so someone has to. <laughs> 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 See how invested Brown Baller wants to get with his pair of sevens. Brown Baller does pay him off. T-1000 wins a relatively small one. That's production, not dealers? Yeah. Not dealers or something? Not dealers, yeah. But they take dealer tape out of their collection. Yeah. I don't like to do it in Austin, I think. Yeah, um, bigger games. They, only the yeah, only bigger games I mean, do like they. The they don't do it on every stream. Oh, they don't. No, it's oh. it's self tip. Oh. For most of the small ones. I didn't know that. But when it gets higher stakes, they go to uh, raise. They go to time or the right. like left, bomb pot or whatever it is. Yeah, one person pays it. Yeah, yeah. That's the only format I've ever seen when I go there. You you don't play five ten. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, that makes sense. Yeah. So in the 510, it's just. You usually play the biggest games there, so. Yeah. Yeah. I've only played big at the lodge like three times. Okay. One of them was with you. Yeah, I remember. Yeah. I was like, I'm not going to let Mariano four bet me. And I, I, remember I ripped that's, the very first hand. That's when you lit your stack on fire. Yeah. That was awesome. Yeah. <laughs> Good times. <laughs> Good yeah. times. Ace deuce. How do you do? It was like the first hand we, the first hand we played. I'm, I'm, I'm all in. Join the club. Look, I'm going to show him who's boss here. It was pretty oh, awesome. Shit. <laughs> it was pretty good. The hand versus neck was pretty gross. Yeah. That was fun. Oh. <laughs> I was ready to pull my phone. I have to be friends as soon as I leave. They're like, why didn't you shut the turn? Thanks, man. Thanks. Let him bluff. <laughs> he probably wouldn't have bluffed on a break, but maybe. Heads up in the main game. Yeah. 
Dylan. Oh, bastard. Sneaky, sneaky. Somebody's been working on their game. I don't know if there's any doubt about that. Dylan Flashner showing the five. Something I always caution people when you play poker, you know, against somebody and then you see them months later and you're like, oh, I know that guy. That guy plays like, you know, ABC or XYZ or whatever it is, right? And you realize that, you know, how that particular player played three months ago, six months ago, a year ago, is not necessarily how they play now. And I think it's really important, if you want to be a winning player, to you know, have an open mind to the fact that your opponent's game is evolving and changing. Playing some game at Aria. They said he had played the day before. Oh, like last week or something? Um, it was on Monday. Oh, Justin Young's game? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, he got, he got wrecked in that game. Mariano Raisin gets called in two spots. Take a look at an 8 7 4 2 club board. Big flop here for Dylan. He's got the overs and the flush draw. Recycler's got a pair of eights. the other day, right? Like last week or two weeks ago or something? I think I, st I doubled against you or something. I don't remember. It was a few weeks ago, before the cruise. What's, what's good here? Oh, today? yes. Mariano. You remember? <laughs> uh, what's good here on the menu? Yeah, yeah. Food menu. Um, I can't remember the So hand, the black and salmon is really good? Okay. Taxes, okay. death, and action Dan 3-betting Dylan Flashner. Three things you can count on. Me and the other guy had the same hand. Me and JT. And for once, it does look like Action Dan will get the best of Dylan on this one. You like made it. You made it like like three thousand pre-flop, and then I called, and then he called, and then on the flop I just went all in, and you folded. 
Yeah. It was like 10 9 something. Yeah. You know what? Sometimes Jeremy orders is good. She's a salad with little shrimps on top. Mm. Yeah. Oh, it's it's happy. Yeah. Oh, I see it. Yeah, but it's not in the menu. You have to. Oh, you have to ask for it. Yeah. I think that Flasher saying that he would have gotten there had he called. Yeah. He's there with shrimp. I would have got yeah. there. No, I didn't know that. What? I got there. Doing again. <laughs> What's he up to? Is he in Arizona now? My inside straight John. He's here. yeah. He just had to. He had some stuff he was going through. I would have got there in my I imagination. Yeah, but that's why I love He'll your game. Back. You never know what you have in your head. You know? He has a lot of things to take it out. And do you have a cup of ice too? Okay, thank you. Here you go. Thank you. I straddle too. I got good cards. I need a 20 back one. Get a raise here from Action Dan with a pretty trashy 8-4 suited. This is like and a PLO hand. We're going to see this one yeah. three way, four ways, pardon me. This is how I would play PLO. Check. And uh, everybody's got around the same hand, like the 10s, the 9s, the 9-5, nine the 8-4. Action Dan's going to rep this, and he's going to win it right here. Uh, I, I have to imagine the hand's over now. Easy. <laughs> How much are you in for? 100? More? <laughs> One and a half. 150? Yeah. <clears throat> I'm in for 100. <clears throat> You're in for 102? 100, yeah. Francisco's in for 800. Did Pepe win something for me? Huh? Did Pepe win something for me? No, Mariana at the beginning, and then Francisco. Yeah. I mean, how funny is the Queens, though? Like, you've seen it a hundred times. Like, <laughs> he just goes all in. Yeah, when the guy just ripped one pair, and, you know, it's always... Yeah. Yeah. 200. 2,500. It was pretty sick how you knew it the whole way, though. <laughs> Damn news. Like, like, the whole time, and I mean, he's just the, shaking his head. No, the funniest thing is he was like, do some clubs. And I was like, four of yeah. clubs. Yeah. And he was like, do some clubs. And then... Do some Two clubs. clubs. <laughs> How does he call it? That's that's sick. That's what that's what it means to be a super pro. <laughs> Francisco the super pro. No, I need to win a big tournament. <laughs> you need to win a big Good tournament. Good here. I have my turtle. You just I have, have to, lucky. You just have to call the cards and you'll win. Just call them. Oh, he called the cards. <laughs> yeah, he was like, this is a club, and I, it I came. Was in there. Yeah, yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah, he, he literally called he, the river. He, he just shoved 30,000 and 10,000 on like queens. jack five three, all clubs. I have pocket fives. Oh, I call. Yeah. He has queens of the club. More, the turn is like off two four. Well, the, 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 the river. He's like, do some clubs, do some clubs. 
the club, do the club, man. The club was, <laughs> was uh, Jack 4 something, right? Yeah, club. Jack 5, oh, Jack 5, yeah. 3 or something. Queen of clubs. <laughs> I said, I don't think he's... <laughs> I went all in, he snapped coming with set of five. <laughs> Turn nothing, River said, do so clap, do so clap hand. How did you know, Francis? So Queen's good hand today. Yeah. For me, yes. Yeah. No, <laughs> for no, for, no, no, no for Dan. He had, for when I had ten, he had Queen's. Yeah. That had I block. Oh, yeah, yeah. I just, oh. I just saw it. Well, it was good for him, he just folded it. What did he so have? Queens are good. No, if he cocky wins. I know, but I'm saying like it's been the winning hand all day. For me. For everyone. You know? It's a winning hand for him too. He just. No, if he keep, no, if he lose. But if you call, he wins. Yeah. Yeah, but how can he call? He can't the king. Yeah. <laughs> I'm surprised he thought that long. Yeah. He knew Francisco oh, was up to something, and he was. He had fucking tens. I think he had king. Yeah. Been a lot of funny hands, weird hands today. Yeah. I had a weird one against you, Bala. Mm. Hmm. Mm. When I folded my set? my set? Oh, the other one when I check raised you huge? Mm. Yeah, I might have gotten owned. Mm. As, as, it, as it goes. <laughs> rip. 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 It's 125 yeah. to post or a Or you can straddle for a thousand. Or you can wait one hand and come in. Straddle for a thousand. <laughs> you can straddle for 300. Yeah, but you can straddle for a thousand. I'll, I'll, you I'll, could also yeah, straddle yeah. for a thousand yeah, if you wanted to. <laughs> if you straddle for 300, it'll be easier to go all in. <laughs> yeah, that's true. I'm just letting you know. It'll be a lot easier. <laughs> <laughs> I sense a double up coming, Jared. <laughs> for me. For me. No. I know you are. You're a patient player. Yeah. I don't get attached to my loss. Action Dan raising it up with a six. Mariano, three, three betting. Uh, well, I'm in for 13. Yeah. Yeah. Guys, tell me your order of New York State. Yeah, me. Lauren stepping out. Magical step in. Got about an uh, hour and 20 minutes left in our show. Take a look at our leaderboard. Francisco up big. Mariano, T1000, both up five figures. Brown Balla and Action Dan are down big. Brown Balla down $66,500. And when I shoved 40000 into Dan, I just had trips. Texas last three years. You don't remember that? <laughs> Last time I remember What's playing with you, I fucked off a bunch it's, against you. That was the time. It's the best yeah, I've here. ever found. Yeah, I'm, like, yeah. not, I'm not saying like the action, you, but like the people. He was here, you were there, I like was the, there. The niceness like, and like, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, I love so Yeah. They're yeah. <laughs> just such kind people. Like, you. We awesome. have so many good, good, good people. Sounds good, for sure. I like that. I'm trying to find my sound. I'm trying to find my sister. That's the brown ball I'm used to. He's got like that. Actually, Dan, our most active player at the table. He's improved a lot already. He's gotten better. Yeah, but I've less now. Brown Bella, you improve a lot. Now you lose, you lose less. I was always good. I lose less. Francisco is next, next level needles. Now you're getting so much better at poker. Now you lose less. T1000's got kings. Mariano had some... Uh, Nefarious thoughts, but decides to let it go. Yeah, he loses less now. <laughs> it's improving. Yeah, Keep only down improve two, every year. Only down 200K in two seconds. Maybe next year break even. Way less. Maybe next year you break even. <laughs> yeah, maybe. Uh, or maybe you go down. It depends if your queen's hold or not. Yeah, you're in. <laughs> so you call me. Do you me. want the straddle dance? Do you guys want to do auto 100? 
Yeah. Sure. Sounds good. So it sounds like they're going to put an automatic straddle in there. So 25, 50, 100. What? This game's getting bigger. What did they say? Okay? Automatic 100. Auto 100? Auto yeah, sure. Okay. You straddle or you race? I straddle. Oh, I didn't know that. <laughs> I said straddle. Like, it makes no difference. Thank you. You see? So straddle is on. Okay. Really? I didn't know if I was two or three. Oh, no, you're three. Cool. I'm two. I was trying to make Dan pay again. <laughs> Yeah, Mariano, not a believer. Francisco's bet on the turn just does not pass the sniff test. Does make the call. See if Mariano wants to uh, call him down one more time. Does Francisco put him to the test? He bet the turn. Backdoor clubs got there. You'd like to have a club in your hand if you're making that play, but... Francisco telling a story that he's got something pretty good. Mariano is just a bluff catcher. Eight hundred in the pot. Not a big one, but these are always interesting. The bluffs, the possible hero calls. Sort of fold. Francisco doesn't bluff too often. <coughs> we saw him bluff earlier with tens. And that was for a big bet. This one's small, but he's trying it. Sorry, one more minute. A minute? No, 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 no more minutes. You got like 10 seconds, dude. Yeah, Hurry up. It's okay. If you have kings, it's okay. <laughs> 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 no, 
And eventually Mariano does fold and Francisco shows the bluff. Francisco loves to advertise his bluffs. Again, he doesn't bluff that often. So he loves to advertise them. Tries to get as much out of them as he can, you know? Good play, brother. I learned from Ron Bella. <laughs> That's a good player to learn from. When I did that, I got called. Oh, tired of getting bluffed today. <laughs> you guys are punters. <laughs> yeah. He's down a lot. Damn? Oh, yeah. He's He'll be okay. down like the same yeah. as me. No, yeah, but. He said he's in 150. Eh? He's in 150. He'll be okay. So he's only down like 50. Well, that's four, that's thousand. more than a hundred. Yeah, so way more than a hundred. That's like one twenty, one thirty. Respect. <laughs> a lot of respect. I need to build a little bit here, so I can have yeah. more fun. You know? Thank you. Rachel. It's building time. Yeah. We are back at it tomorrow night, Thursday night. Don't want to miss that. And then, of course, Friday, our big game. Always fun. I'll be back at it next week. Next week, by the way, I'll be commentating, I, I believe, three days. Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Next week is my schedule. Of course, subject to change. Brown Bella, Nickerball Tishim. <laughs> this guy, Doc Pock. Dylan has had nines today. Mariano, I want to say like four <laughs> times, three times. And this one Uncanny. <laughs> and uh, get your ducks in a row. No, That's right. No, but, deuce, uh, deuce, deuce. Me and you. Brown Bala with the ace. He can win this with a deuce or an ace, by the way. T1000 with the overs. To Dylan's nines. And he linked each him. <laughs> and flash there. Garrett teach him. Gonna call yeah. here. That ball teach him, and Nick Herbal teach that guy. And this guy might get. Probably Brown Baller. Brown Baller gets out of the way. <laughs> now T1000 can win this with a deuce, a king, or a ten. Nine's still good. Pepe teach me, but not right. Mm. No. I think T1000 is uh, very aware of the fact that he does not have to bet all three streets to bluff. We saw him earlier on do that. And Dylan's nines are good. See how he decides to play it. Does he bet here for value? Yeah. He does. Before he went on Thank you. <laughs> that sign guy is so funny. I'm Thank you, Dave. What's that? Is it that guy, the sign guy. Have you seen him? The sign guy? Yeah, he's like a guy that he holds doesn't, He doesn't have sign. Twitter, so he oh, wouldn't yeah, know. I'm not on Twitter, dude, well, so this, whatever like, you're getting old, from there. There's, just... this, there's this old, it, he's, it was standing outside of here for a while, too. He, like, just wore, held a sign out that was like, Gary, give the money back, like, Make things right, something like that. What? He's like some old Asian guy. He worked yeah. for Hustler or just no. some random dude? <laughs> that would be hilarious. No, he's just some random guy that I heard about the story. Well, why would, that, like, why would someone to... just stand there wasting their time? Bro, oh, they uh, that's him. what he did. That's what he did. What the hell? His name is the sign guy. The sign like, guy. Yeah. He's got a name? 
He like when like when Gary was playing uh, on like some other stream or something, he was like trying to go up to him to like record him and ask him why oh Gary was before I know. <laughs> just like get away from me. <laughs> Take it. Oh You're God. too good to follow. No, no, no. Like um, I had a hand. Yeah. I fall King Jack. Wow. <laughs> no. Come on. Come on. Like Francisco, I know you better. I said, like, had to throw right in the Canadian part, eh? Huh? I said, had to throw in the Canadian part. No, I think he's yeah. Canadian. Jack, I, 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 old Asian Canadian guy. He's Canadian. Oh, yeah, a little too close. I heard that he traveled all the way from Canada just to do this. As the game has gotten better, the talk has gotten better as well. Hopefully it continues for the next hour. You won't hear much from me then. But I'm sitting here enjoying the show just like you. I'll send you, I'll send you, I'll send you a picture of his yeah, sign. Is he there now? No. no, probably not. He was here for a couple of weeks. Yeah, a couple of weeks. Just like standing outside like all day. Yeah. 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 Oh. This is like a couple months ago, I think. How much? 1500. Nope. Nope. Oh, let's go. Heads up. Dylan three betting here with the ace king. Recycler makes the call, and Recycler uh, pretty ambitious yeah. this call. Does have a pair of fives as he outflops Dylan. Dylan's got the king of spades. I, I probably would have opted to bet this flop, but I think checking is certainly reasonable. <laughs> I don't believe that. Doesn't he have a coach for fighting? He has no coach for fighting. No, no, no. Believe in it. He said he don't believe in it. Oh, wow. And Recycler's just got everything here. He's got a pair of fives. He's got the flush draw. He said, I don't know. We were playing other games. You should find a teacher. I don't believe that shit. I like, I like the way I play. That's why you feel Fifteen. Fifteen hundred. Yeah. Have you seen what's going on with him on social media right now? Oh, uh, it's like some debt or something. Right? This guy. I know. I think Ryan's like losing his mind or something. Oh really? Or it seems that way. It might just all be a stunt for uh, yeah. building publicity for the fight. Uh, Probably is that. Okay. But, um, I saw his Instagram and he was like being weird and stuff. That's good. Interesting. You should look at it if you remember. Right. It's definitely some memes on Very <laughs> awful river card for Dylan Flashner as he hits his king, but it is the flush for Recycler. $8,100 in there. And Recycler's only got $6,700 behind. All in. Oh. I call. All in and I have a king. Oh, what? What you doing? <laughs> 65, 75. Nice hand. Thank you. Yeah, pretty uh, pretty awful river if you are a Dylan Flashner fan. If he gets to the river, it's going to be very, very difficult for him not to lose a lot of money. Wow. Thank you. Sorry. Wow. That dirty river just yeah, this day. What do you have, Dylan? Of course. Standard. Oh. Standard Dylan hand. Make a super good hand and it's no good. Day in the life. And then, of course, 5 3 works. I think that's what happened last time with us. You, you I, remember I, you rivered two pair and I rivered the yeah, straight? That's what it was. Yeah, that's what it was. Don't two you remember? <laughs> That's it. great. Hey, he's got Do you remember that time yeah. when I, I totally uh, coolered you? I remember the fives sort of. against the it jacks. All, all and you lost a lot of money to me? Yeah, yeah let's talk about that more. That, that was a lot of fun, wasn't I it? Over, I went all in with like 10K because I didn't want to pay the bounty. Yeah. <laughs> and oh. Get stuck with jacks against him. <laughs> oh, yeah? oh, boy. <laughs> all for the bounty. Oh, boy. Yeah. Did you play that bounty day? Great. Hey, yeah. Um. What's uh, that? Yeah. 3,200. Did I what? Did you play the bounty game? Yeah, I played the first one. Was it fun? Yeah, it was fun. It was just a little bit small, but it was fun otherwise. Even with 30K in bounties, it was small? No one tried to win like five in a row? I ran hot, dude. You won five in a row. And then you won it? Mariano and Action Dan involved in this one. Neither one with a particularly good hand. But look at that. Four bet from Action Dan. It was a lot. Gotta love it. Uh, it's hard to keep track of 
We've got an hour left in our show, and this has uh, been a really fun night, no doubt about it. There's like seven different types of any other gears? Yeah. You never know what somebody's on. Well, so once someone wins all five, does it? Is there no more bounties? There's no more yeah. bounties. I, no. But you could like post up again if you want. If you want to like post the bounties again, to. but it didn't happen that time. I won six in a row though, so I won the whole thing. <laughs> <laughs> nice. The whole table didn't try to stop you at the end. I would be like, guys, and yeah. no one fall this hand. We're not going to let him win it. <laughs> I know you'd be like, <laughs> you'd be full would, blast mode. Whatever. Yeah, exactly. It's but who cares? The, but the bounty's not your money. You don't have to protect it. It's yeah, but then I can't win it. It's a pride thing. Then I can't win it. Yeah, that's it. Yeah. <laughs> but I ran hot, like, some of those hands for sure, yeah, so there wasn't yeah. much they could I mean, do. Yeah. I was at hitting top pair. Yeah, at the like, end it matters a lot, I guess. Yeah. I was hitting top pair with like stupid hands hey, and stuff. You did you did great. I know you were gonna say that. I can read your mind there. I'm like, 1600. I know. I know you're right. But this is the last day. Okay. Okay. Tomorrow's a new day and start fresh from the farm. None of the energy stuff. Yeah. Seriously. 1600. You should do that for yourself. Right. All in. No, no, you're right. All you can eat. Right. Absolutely. I want to see a flop. What do you want to run it to? You're, 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 the, you're the one that's stuck, so... Just, it's okay, go, you can choose it. I, 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 no, no, I feel for him, like, he, he can I, I always let my opponent uh, choose. All right, we can run it twice. Twice. Two times. It feels good. Right. So we're going to run it twice here, Action Dan no, and been, Dylan. Uh, Ace-Jack versus nines. Any ace, any jack, any nine. There's a king. Dylan's got the first one. And he made spades. So Dylan does not hit an ace or a jack on that run out and wins it. So he's got a decent chance of scooping this one. Let's see what happens. There's an ace. Can he fade the nine? Diamond? Or diamond. No. Flush for each of them. And they chop it up. You, you called the uh, Francisco. You called it on the very river. <laughs> yeah, way of doing it. He has to say the specific card. Well, oh, that's true. Yeah. yeah. He was close. It was like 50 50. <laughs> he had to learn a little bit. Yeah, if he, if he said the specific yeah, card, then it's then it's one video one worthy, right? The hand of the year. I can just straddle. Yeah. yeah. 200 straddle. Copy. Can you pass me the button, please? Yeah, but what about a straight flush? Yeah. People in the oh. chat pointing out what Mariano just said. He would have had a straight flush. But then I would have felt so bad for them. <laughs> no flush, no because the hood is on. I don't know what I would have done. Oh my god, we might have never seen Dylan again. Yeah, that's probably my last. Good time fold. Here. Pat yeah, myself on the back yeah. there. For real. <laughs> oh my god. No, it's 800. Crazy to 800. King Jack six, two clubs out there, nothing for either player. Action Dan will bet and probably win this one right here, you'd assume. Four hundred. Four hundred. Thank you, Dan. Magic and Lauren, as always, doing an amazing job. Sure. Yeah. What did say? Two hundred. We continue to uh, battle seven ways at this table. 200? 200 is okay. So we, okay. Do we actually stand up? No. no. It's bad for the camera. It's the other way as in Austin. Like, you got a button once you win. Win a hand? Can you get multiple buttons? No. Sometimes, but not. Not this, today? Not today. Okay. That has to be, like, established or whatever. And the penalty is 200? 200 per person. You have to show your hand. So if your hand releases, it doesn't count. Okay. And don't run it. Fine. You run so bad. So we are playing the stupid game, the standard game, call it what you will. Win a pot, get a dot. But you must show your hand. Last person to win a hand, or get a dot, I should say, owes everybody at the table 200 bucks. It's only seven players in the game, though, so. I think they should probably do 300. 
it's a really small penalty. I like to call it the nit tax. But I mean, I mean, you're talking about like, okay, so if you're the last one to win a hand, you lose 1,200 bucks. That's just not that big a deal. I think the size of the game, I mean, the, how many players are in the game has to be factored in when you're looking at how much to pay out. Yeah, you see these guys just go to go to war over it all. T one thousand's obviously got the goods. He's got kings. And Mariano makes the call. Mariano has him covered. T one thousand with sixty thousand behind. Recycler gets out of the way. Kings versus sevens. Oh, and there's a seven. Mariano has flopped a set. And while I mentioned the stand-up game is not for a lot of money, still that adds an element to it. It often induces the action. And look at T-1000 checking it back. A little bit of pot control for T-1000. Also disguising the strength of his hands. See if Mariano goes pot here. Mariano checks again. And now T1000 is going to bet for value. So he checks back the flop, bets the turn. 4,500, and now, what's the play if you're Mariano? I mean, it's a wet enough board that I kind of like, I kind of like check raising here. T1000's hand is under-repped. He could level himself into thinking that Mariano is just making a move because his hand is under-repped. Yeah, and Mariano is going to raise here. I like it. I like it a lot. 14 large. And this is the one thing that happens when you, you check back the flop and you bet the turn. You put yourself in a situation where you're trying to think, well, is my opponent attacking my perceived weakness? Or do they actually have something? And I don't think T1000 can fold just yet. It's 9,500 to call. The pot is 28,150. He'll have a decision to make on the river, though, depending on what comes out. All right, let's go. An eight would be a straight. And that's certainly one of the hands that Mariano could have. Certainly could have had some sort of eight X of hearts type hand. You know, if you're thinking about a semi bluff. I think T1000 can get away from this, depending on the sizing of this bet. Mariano has just effectively moved all in. He has bet enough where if T-1000 calls, it's for all of his chips. And I think T-1000 can get away from this again. Mariano's going to have it some of the time when he check raises the turn. And the times he doesn't have it, he's going to have a lot of semi-bluffs. And some of those are do include an eight.
Then again, Mariano probably knows a T-1000 doesn't have that eight. So he can certainly try to rep it if he didn't have it. Not an easy spot with King, but I do think T-1000 can find the fold. Mariano took six minutes for a $3,300 river call. I think we can give T-1000 a few moments as well. Pot is $83,000, it's 45 to call. T-1000 not quite getting two to one, as Mariano bets more than pot on the river. Sorry. One or two more minutes. For what it's worth, I actually kind of like these tanks. Let's just think about the hand a little bit. Put yourself in his situation. <clears throat> And I'm not an advocate for stalling or tanking, but in these kind of spots, I like it. Oh, this is close. Nines, tracks. Leaning towards fold. What do you have? Uh, over pair. You want to show one? <laughs> Can't. Can't show one? Hmm. There's a price. Okay. Let's see. What is that price? 10,000. That's a hefty price. I'm gonna have to decline. All right. I find it interesting. Ah. Sorry guys, I'm like so 50-50 here. No worry, no worry. Big pot. $83,000 pot, if he makes the call, it'll be well over 100,000. Yeah, well, th this is like uh, six minutes, seven minutes. That was like five, three minutes or something. Huh? Yeah, that was crazy. How, how long? 23 minutes or something, yeah. The stream almost caught up. Doug came in the room and I was like, guys, the stream is catching up. All right. Because <laughs> they only do a 30 minute. I think. I think I'm going to have to fold. 
I can't do it. It's so hard. It's so hard to let this go. He does eventually find the fold. Nice lay down. Really nice lay down. Oh, yeah. Well, that's good. Is one pair good? <laughs> Mariano didn't want to show. Yeah, he said, watch it on stream. He watch consciously, on consciously on didn't show. Man. He was like, this bluff will be too tilting to show him. I can't show. <laughs> I think you made me say you should go all he in on the turn. He sacrificed the button. What's that? You should go all in on the turn. Thank you. You should go all in on the turn. Let me write that down. Now you have a new coach. No, not mine. You can replace Doug Puck with Francisco the Pro. I thought that was a good price. that was very well. Very well price structured. If he bought the card and then called, how would it work? I keep the 10 no matter what. Yeah, but then you win 10 less because he pays it off the stack. I think he had the best So that's the same. It's a free roll. <laughs> he sees it as like, I think you did. Yeah, but what if he's rolling? Oh, yeah. Or what if he pays what if he's right? Yeah, then he makes 10K less, I guess, right? We'll see it in, what, 30 minutes? Person did that to, to Garrett, hour. which was epic. You see that hand where huh? Eric Person did that to Garrett? He charged him like 20K. Yeah. That was epic. Dude. Did Garrett yeah. pay? Yeah, he paid. And then he yeah, still pulled it. And then he 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 pulled it. He had the two, like one hand that other card he picked. Oh, it didn't matter, yeah. That's that was like Garrett's worst day here. Yeah, that shit was entertainment. That person was just sick. Yeah. Person was the professor that day. Oh. Interesting oh. hands. Aces? Kings? Yeah. Thought you had aces. Really cool spot. That was a very cool hand. Yeah. I thought it was interesting that the second T1000 mentioned that he was leaning toward folding, Mariano started talking. Maybe lucky. Maybe to save you money. Maybe. He was quiet until that pretty moment. Pretty hard for him to bluff there. Maybe kind of like Queen 10. That'd be pretty good. Bella, who you see had the best hand? That hand? Yeah. How can you tell when you? I win think Mariano hand? probably had the best hand. I think I bet he had the best. hand. Pretty enticing to show a bluff there, right? We're playing the nick game. <laughs> Uh, yep. I, I bet to anybody but Mariano, he had the best hand. <laughs> Thirsty Thursdays, Julia, Action Dan, and Christian Soto all playing tomorrow night. Come join us. Soto is in the chat. He's been commentating a ton. And he is going to be on our table tomorrow night playing 10, 20, 40. Palmdale, Action Dan again, Christian Soto. This should be a fun one. Make sure you join us. All the action starts at 5 p.m. Pacific. so much I think you're full of shit. I just, I don't want to go crazy. Yeah, yeah, it is telling, by the way, they are playing the stupid yeah. game. I gotta go to the bathroom in the game. And <laughs> even with man. that, it's fine. You're up. Mariano did it's not show, but Mariano does have his button ready. You're not? No. Oh, okay. Who's up there? <laughs> My, uh, no, Dan Hardman no, says, uh, anytime you can get your opponent to start talking, it's a tell. I just, I mean, not always. It's just a situation where you just got to pay attention to it. Try to think, okay, why is he talking now? Hey. Right? He's pretty strong not to show him. I mean, he wasn't talking. I didn't ask him a question, and yet, some for some reason, he felt prompted to start talking. You just got to ask yourself, why? Right? I mean, tells are interesting because I think for different people, the same exact action can be different, can can actually be meant to be different. You know what I mean? Three. By the way, flush draw versus flush draw here, recycler could get themselves in a lot of trouble. Three thousand is the best. I used to play with a buddy of mine. If, of course, we see a river, and I don't think recycler can fold because he's got a straight draw to go along with the flush draw. <laughs> By the way, Brown Ball also has a straight draw to go along with the flush draw. Queen High is good right now, though. I'll never forget this. It was like 500 bucks, Dan. And he had it against his buddy or his rival or whatever. I remember playing with a guy a long time ago. And somebody thought, oh, 
the guy's got the nuts or something because the guy, the man's hands were shaking. And it was only later on that, you know, we found out that, that was invited. He couldn't control his shaking hands. Whether he had a good hand, whether he had a bad hand, whether he was bluffing, whether he had the nuts, just to make a difference. His hands always shook. <laughs> it's like five I mean, I, I just don't think tells are as like, it's not like rounders where you're going to see some dude eating Oreo cookies. Yeah. Just messing around. And then I went outside to go meet my Uber driver for delivery. Mm -hmm. And I come back, I'm running back inside. And then I'm like, the dealer's like, do you want your, you want a hand? I'm like, yeah, straddle. Mm -hmm. I straddle. And the bad beat jackpot gets hit. Dylan Flashner, by the way, in the chat. As you know, we are on a delay, so the game has ended already. But we still have about, I think about 35, 40 minutes left. Yeah, like I just came back and like, yeah, just luckily I... There's all you can eat. Dylan versus Mariano. A tale as old as time. Took the words out of my mouth. Got eight. <laughs> Free bet here for Mariano. Dylan is all in. Not this time. Dylan is just not putting up with Mariano's <laughs> stuff at all. I mean, I think he just realizes that Mariano is three betting really light <laughs> and raising really light. That is king. <laughs> I, don't know if I, I don't know if I like this new Dylan. <laughs> you don't like the new Dylan? Well, you created him. Yeah. <laughs> so you have to deal with it. Yeah. I like the sensible. <laughs> yeah, you like the like guy who doesn't bluff and uh, he just kind of plays the way you're supposed to. Yeah. I miss him too. Hustler Casino Live is a disease. It, it, it has now spread to Dylan as well. You look down at King Queen, you're like, fuck yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Any other game, you're like, uh oh, King Queen. <laughs> Keep coming back. One thousand. Yeah, good point, Dan Hardman in the chat. Generally speaking, I agree with you. King Queen, nine flop. Fours are good, but Recycler can't be too happy with them. A lot of outs here for action, Dan. He can catch a nine, a queen, an ace, or a five. But not a six. Like I'm like, oh my god. <laughs> Drawing dead in this game. <laughs> yeah. That game is not fun. Yeah. I don't stand a chance. If I don't, if I don't play fun games, I'm, I'm just toast. I tried asking for a round of straddles, and this German started explaining like how it negatively impacts his win rate. For <laughs> That's like, funny. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So I give up. We're gonna go play baccarat. That sounds insane. What is? Three hundred. Call. Pump it up, Michael Jordan, 2300. Oops. Oh. You have a button? Oh, you have a button. He don't have no button. One, two. Three people, we don't have no button. Mariano's thinking about doing something crazy here. There's a lot of dead money in the pie. Yep. I thought it. You can see it coming. I mean, there's $8,000 in the pot. He's like, I want it. Let me see if I can take it. Brown Baller certainly knows that Mariano is capable of doing this light. But he's got six high. See what action Dan wants to do with fives.
He is not going to call. He is going to call. Wow. He's only got 29,000 behind. Now 20,000. Brown ball is SPR is like 0.5. And everybody misses. Nobody has nothing. Mariano's got overs and a gut shot. Action dance fives are good. And the pot is $36,600. I think Mariano's right. Hustler Casino Live is a disease, and all three of these players have it. Mariano with the down bet, and he is going to win it. Maybe. He is going to win it. <laughs> Mariano's stealing it now. <laughs> Magic steps out. Lauren steps in. I believe this will be the last. I was like, if I call it, Dan will call. There'll be 30,000 in the oh, dealer of the right. night. I can get unstuck if I just hit low cards. Give us a moment to talk about Friday's game. Mike X, Jeremy Kaufman, Ludacris, Texas Mike, Charles, Brazil God, and Lingland. Lingland is just one of my favorites. I love watching her play poker. They're playing 5,100 on Friday. Everything starts at 5 p.m. Pacific. Make sure you are here. Well, I guess the low cards wouldn't have been nice because you probably would have hit a set. <laughs> <laughs> I just wanted to yeah, maybe, it, maybe it comes like two, three, four. <laughs> <laughs> I should have pulled it. I was too shallow to call. If I had like 60 or something, I probably could have called. Shallow, what's again? But whatever. Flash there's not fucking around. That's well, definitely you. No, I don't have a high card. Oh, no, no, I'm, no, I'm, I'm still dead. Yeah, he's still. He's like, that's definitely you, and it's. I'm. No matter what you have, I'm dead. Eights are good. Back Dylan's gonna double up. Twenty thousand. So five's no good for Action Dan against Mariano. Five's no good against Dylan Flashner. So do. Bring back the old Dylan. I'll bring him next week. Don't worry about it. Nine thousand four hundred fifty. That's what you keep saying. I know. And then that keeps showing up different. Or... <laughs> yeah. I'm going to be curious for another like 40 minutes. Very curious. Oh, yeah. Is that 240? He'll let you know at some point. Good fold, by the way, if you are watching this show. And how much do I have? You don't have to fold. For free. Okay. 40 minutes. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh. Nice. That's right. They're grumpy. Dude had pocket fives back to back and lost both times. Called when he was behind, folded when he was ahead. Small pocket pairs are tough to play, you know? Don't flop a set and then just like guessing where you're at. Oh, 
Dylan's got nines again. Are you fucking kidding me? Dylan, if you're in the chat, how many times have you had nines today? Is that like the sixth time, fifth time? Unbelievable. I mean, keep in mind, in a five-hour stream, maybe we get 23 hands in an hour, 24 hands in an hour. Uncanny to get pocket nines that often. In fairness, I think they held up almost all the time, right? Your nines? I mean, the only really significant loss of the night, the ace-king hand where you hit the king on the river versus the flush, and then, of course, the ace's hand versus 4-3 of diamonds. I kind of like this bet. Action Dan just not getting the right price here. Not quite getting two to one. And I mean, you're not beating, you have seven high. Pick a number, Dylan, one or three. How's a deuce? Huh? How's a deuce? A deuce? <laughs> Breaks, breaks the number check. <laughs> That's a good answer. Um. Action Dan is stuck. If he calls this, it's because he's Action Dan, and it's because he's stuck. He knows he should not be calling this, clearly. Hmm. I mean, even if you, even in a world where you thought your seven was good, your five was good, and a diamond were good, you're not getting the right price. But how can you ever imagine that a seven or a five would be good here? I'm gonna be action Dan if I didn't call this. There you go. You said I'm not action Dan if I don't call there, and he does call. You always choose, Dylan. One time. One time. Can Dylan fade the diamond? 41-6 in nine. the pot. Here it is. <laughs> seven, oh, Did ouch. Oh my. Oh. Oh. Can I get chips? Definitely action Dan. Behind that one. Yeah. Ouch. 100% action Dan. So stacking Dan. Wow. Dylan says one time they run it once, the Jack of Diamonds on that river. And uh, what has been a crazy roller coaster night for that man and Dylan just continues. It's a zero sum game. Tragic. Just absolutely tragic for Dylan. But uh, a huge pot and a huge win for Action Dan. It's that damn river, man. I'm telling you, it's my pain in my existence. We should just play to the turn. I, someday, Dylan, you, you destroy everybody. I'm gonna create a new yeah. game. It's just called. <laughs> it's called four card poker. Hold on, I'm turn first. card hold'em. Yeah, your first turn card hold'em. Hold I like that. I like that. Some TC hold'em. Mm -hmm. yeah. One second. Thank you so much.
15, right? That's correct. Yeah. So should be good, Lauren. Thank you, brother. Yeah. 13. Um, How much? 3,000. 3,000. I mean, what can you do? 3,800. I'd probably call it the same thing to be honest. I'd like to, I'd like to gamble. Don't worry, I defend for you. Here, sweat. Yeah, you have a straight draw too. 1,500. Francisco, not a believer, and ace queen is good right now. $3,700 in the pot. Let's see what happens on the turn. Francisco's got the club, by the way. Sure. Well, brown ball are now with a jack. 3000 Francisco, by the way, has picked up a straight draw and a flush draw. He can also win it with an ace. Three of diamonds, not going to help him. Okay. Check. Aha. <laughs> Good defense. I got lucky. Wow, <laughs> we. Can I get four purple? Um, yeah. Okay. Yep. Wow. I can't believe he didn't raise me. Three plus. I shoot. <laughs> <laughs> well, I talked about this earlier on. This is absolutely insane. Look at this lineup, everybody. May 28th, 29th, 30th, and 31st. Alan Keating, Tony G, Rampage, Jungle Man, Tom Dwan, Doug Polk. Are you fucking kidding me? Wow. Just inject that into my veins now. Nine hundred. Anyone. 
emails to tell me what your hand was. <laughs> Dude, Ryan just told me they didn't read my cards that hand. <laughs> yeah, right. I'll tell you after, but you said that they didn't read the cards. Come on. I'm sorry. He just told me right now. You just went back there and said, erase no, the he cards? Found me. He found me. I, I was just going to the bathroom. Yeah. Come on. <laughs> Yeah. Well, it looks like we're going to have a it's giant flip for a lot of money. Who doesn't like a giant flip for a lot of money? Yeah. Action Dan, by the way, is 4-bet to 6,400. Recycler is all in. Brown ball is not going to fold. What? They just missed one of the bigger pots of the night. Take it up with them, bro. We're going to get a flip for a ton of money hmm. with some dead money in there because I think Action Dan will probably be out of the way. <laughs> Although you never know with that guy. He's crazy. <laughs> I was thinking to myself, like, oh, shit. Yeah. That's some, that's some shit. All in. <laughs> yep, there's the all in from Brown Bala. I had, I had fucking some. Now, yeah, Action Dan is truly nice all action. He'll call this, too. But I, I, even he can't call here, right? Disrespect. <laughs> Not Action Dan. No, that was actually a really good play. I was like, damn it, once you put in the raise. I, I, thought, like, I thought it was going to go three bet four. Uh, right. Yeah. Raise, re raise the first hand in the game. That was a good play. Just got lucky that I hit it. How much? 45,475. <laughs> Calculating what would be an acceptable amount to be stuck in this current game. I'm in 120. I mean, the problem calling here is he's, he has to realize that he's up against an overpair, right? What? Are you fucking, what is going on here? Sure, I have queens. Twice confirmed. They're going to run it twice. We got jack nine of spades versus ace king of hearts versus queens. Spades are live. Action Dan's winning this, right? No way he would take that long. <laughs> Man, don't even. <laughs> no, no, no. Well, you guys have no spades, right? That's a good thing. Dan will let you know what he has at the river. <laughs> what is going on? Pot's as good as Pot's $111,000. Now, by the way, Recycler is in for 60. The side pot is 51. This, this, this. They're going to run it twice. That is a really good start for Recycler. So Recycler's going to get at least half of the 60000 By the way, Queen's held on that run. So Brown Ball is going to win half the side pot. This is not looking good. At, oh, wait a second. Oh, my. Queen's no good, but a seven. Oh, you got to be kidding me. Oh, my. <laughs> oh my. Okay, so how does this work? Oh, well, uh, they're going to take. The side, right? This is going to take 19 <laughs> minutes to do, by the way, but Lauren's a pro. Totally She'll take care of it. So I lose that stack, and they chop it. Oh, God damn it. <laughs> I can't even win with this. <laughs> wow. I mean, it wasn't even that good a turn card because the queen is no good. <laughs> Action, Dan, <laughs> Action Dan only picks up the straight draw to the lower end of it. I learned from a friend from Disco. <laughs> wow. Rough, rough. How much time we got left on this 
Oh my. Like 20 minutes. Okay. Then I won't reload. <laughs> Does the game break after? Or so you guys want to play? Um, I'd be down to stick around. I would play, but. Yeah, I don't want to get in there. I think Yaka's going to pick me up, but. Yaka's here. Oh, she is? Yeah, she's right there. Oh, okay. Sitting with your lady. Yeah, that's her friend from uh, college. Okay. Thor. Um. Well, I thought I was for sure getting half. <laughs> Spicy. Three. You couldn't even hit that straight with the queen. I don't even know how I don't win both, to be honest with them. <laughs> <laughs> Zach, who plays at Lodge, he got LASIK in the morning and then we played cards at night. Friday night. Same day. Big fine. game. Make sure you join us 5 p.m. It, right? it was only, it's only like 2,500 bucks now, 3,000. Oh, really? It's the best money ever spent, bro. Oh, really? You, you got it too? Yeah. Okay. I, I need to get it. Oh, it, was yeah, the best. Got it. I was a similar story to your buddy. I got it and the next day I was, I was good. Where did you yeah. get it? In LA? Um, well, in Ontario, but it's a company that, that has branches throughout. It's called and vision, like okay. it starts with the letter N, yeah. and then just vision. Okay. And it was like, honestly, the best money I ever spent by a bunch. Okay. Life changing. I woke okay. up the next day, I almost wanted to cry. <laughs> really? yeah. like, holy shit! It's I like, would really like to see. Yeah. I I have awesome. good vision, yeah. and then I got glasses, and just because I had like a slight stigmatism, and I yeah. was like, wow, this is like so much better. And yeah. so now I wear glasses usually, even though I don't really need them. I mean, if you don't mind the glasses, then might as well stick with them, but. For me, it was I mean, like it, it was it. hard to drive even because yeah. I couldn't see like sweet oh, yeah. names. Ayaka's and stuff. like that. She has really bad vision. What did you get? You got the LASIK. Oh, you got LASIK. Yeah, it was just the best. Yeah, Ayaka's like that. She has really bad vision. Does she wear contacts vision. and stuff? No, she has glasses, but okay. she doesn't like wearing them, and she usually doesn't wear them. So like yeah. when she drives, she just like can't see shit usually. Yeah. So you're a, you're a good <laughs> candidate because you're you're a perfect age, but uh -huh. after ten years. It's, yeah. Usually, I, I got LASIK. Yeah, they say like, sometimes you need a second procedure, like 10 years. After 10 years? I can't wait. It was You're going to have awesome. to eventually get classes. They gave me... Oh. Um, did they, did, was it painful? No, no, no. Uh, it I just went. feels like a little bit of pressure. Oh. Uh, yeah. I don't really feel anything. It lasted eight year, 10 years for you? Yeah. 10 good years. Uh, and you can't get it done again? I, I got it from uh, Dr. Maloney, who was the... Uh, he's a LASIK guy for, like, Cindy Crawford. That's why I did it. But you can't get it again? Uh, you can get, um, how much? Um, you can You can get it touched up. Yeah, I did it. You can get it touched up, but it's not really doing you any good. He says, just might as well just get wear some glasses. That's what he said. So, yeah. So you can't get it done twice? No. You can. You can, but it's not really worth it. I think it depends on the individual, on everyone's eyeballs, like how much, because they measure like, I think it's like millimeters or even less than millimeters, whatever that measurement is. Yeah. They measure like how much of your eyeball they can work with. Okay. And some people have a lot and some have a little. Okay. I see. Yeah. 
see. Yeah. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll look into it. Maybe I'll get it done. It was the best, dude. Yeah. I, I could refer you where I went if you like. Okay, yeah. Supposedly, the guy who did my surgery is the same eye doctor for the uh, Chargers. Uh, the NFL cool. team, yeah. You'll definitely you enjoy know, it. You know, Ronnie, he knows he, somebody did for him very nice it. job. Really? Two years Ronnie. ago. Okay, okay. I have his number. Can't say enough good things him. about it. Yeah, no, it yeah. was great. Yeah. He said what the best start came really? for me when yeah. okay. I was playing a hand and I couldn't read the board and yeah. I misread my hand completely. I think oh, when you wait so to the night, I went back uh, to the eye doctor. Just go hang out. You like, yeah, your vision changed. Yeah. So yeah. You're going to get dinner or something after. Last week. Those yeah. are cool, yeah. 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 I was going to say, those look great. I don't something recognize different. you with it. Something different. Definitely well, something different. blue, you know? Yeah, those, those are sick. Yeah. They look good. Yeah. Thank you. I thought they were, honestly, I saw Gucci, I thought you were just wearing style glasses. No, no, no. I was like, all right, Jared. It's the only way I could see. Yeah. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. So I should cool, be, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Once you do it, at least for me, the experience That'll was like, fun. why didn't I do this sooner? Okay. It's just so great. Yeah. After 10 years, you want to do it again, right? That's how yeah, it was definitely. for me with like, that's how it was for me with bosses too. Like yeah, a, a friend from New York. Just, like, everything is so much uh, it's clearer. Like, like it just like nice. reduces like, nice. like you don't have to think of like, yep. like usually when you're looking at something you're like, oh, the, like uh, actually requires like effort. Fitness like, yeah, yeah. And then you end up just like not using your yeah. brain for other things. But he like uh yeah, I used to exposes have to, frauds. If I forgot my glasses to poker, I would have to sit in the five seat like oh and see goob goob. I mean, I misread the Is board the once, but I that, uh, like, welcome to the show guy. Glasses where like I thought on I had the test and I didn't see no, the board like, pair, and I just went all in for like ten thousand over his like no. three thousand bed, and he was he, like, quads, he exposes so like, uh, <laughs> coaches and yeah. fitness you know influencers to edit their photos and then sell. I used to play poker, really, fitness okay. classes and Against shit, those like based guy. off fake oh, results. Really? Yeah, who would bring his wife, and she would tell him the cards, right? And dude, it was fucked up because. One time, we were playing a big pot. We were playing 1-3. Pot was like 1,000. And I hit a flush on the river. And he asked his wife, like, what's the river? And she's like, it's a queen. Oh, but she didn't say the suit. Yeah, and I was like, yo, like, the flush got there. <laughs> but I wasn't sure, like, what yeah, to do, yeah. you know? So, yeah. <laughs> but I was like, I told her, I was like, the flush is there. Yeah. She's like, oh, yeah, sweetheart, the flush is there. He's like, oh, full. <laughs> 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 I like killed my own action. <laughs> yeah. Check. I played at the World Series one time with a guy like that. Yeah. Like, it was just very hard for him to see, so like the other ones had to read out the yeah. and, like, Yeah. My turn? To, like, Yeah, that was an interesting time. It was wild, dude. Sometimes he would ask his wife, like, some in-depth questions. I remember he'd say something like, how fast did he race? <laughs> that was he yeah, That's he would funny. ask his wife, like, for tells how and shit, dude. How fast did he race? I was like, well, hold on. Isn't this, like, collusion now? And then you got, like, you got her interpretation oh, yeah. of the tell. Yeah, you but know? If, I, if you're, like, if Ayaka was playing with me and she was, like, telling me stuff like that, like, you would want her to be telling me. Cause yeah, she would just be reading into things that lady, didn't dude. exist. <laughs> yeah, but, I mean. I'm gonna guess that some random like blind guy's wife at one three is not gonna be like some super psychologist that's gonna be yeah, able to yeah, tell yeah. what everyone has from like their Dude, popular, you should like, piss me off though, because sometimes I'd bet against them and she'd be like, forty five dollars, and she'd be like, he looks nervous. He looks like, nervous. Like, I don't look nervous. I'm just cold. That's funny. <laughs> <laughs> exactly, but like. Then they're just gonna like read into stuff. That's yeah, but there. then sometimes she would like hang him out to dry, you know? Like, <laughs> I have like the stone cold nuts. I don't look nervous at all. She's like, he's, his hands are shaking. You know, I'm like, yeah, well, I got the nuts. <laughs> <That's pretty good. laughs> and he'd be like, oh! Like, sorry, dude. And then he's like, how could you tell me he was <laughs> yeah, nervous? Dude. He had the nuts. <laughs> <laughs> And then it'd be brutal too because when he Action Dan has been given action with all sorts of trash. Finally picks up a real hand. 
Fortunately for Dylan, he doesn't move all in. And hopefully for Dylan, he will miss. And he does. Queen high flop or a king high flop. And Dylan probably would have gone broke again. You guys gonna bet the Masters? What's that? You bet, you bet in the Masters? No. Starts What's tomorrow that? No. The biggest golf tournament oh, in the world. No, I don't know golf. Yeah. Bet, bet <laughs> I don't know the Masters. <laughs> I don't know golf. <laughs> it's fun to bet uh, players to win. I was gonna ask, is it common for golf to, like, do people bet on that sport a lot? As much as other sports? Yeah. Give us your pick. It, Give me your pick, I'll follow Walk, you. Joaquin Neiman. Okay. He 20, sounds 25 like he's to good. one. He's playing, the, he's playing some of the best golf in the world right 25 now. 25 to 1? You get 25 to 1 on him, yeah. So that points. means like every one dollar I get 25? So yeah. if I bet 1,000, I get 25k? Yeah. Okay. Oh, that's if you, sick. Yeah, you're going to get even. You better come right. <laughs> uh, bet has, like 5K. has Brown Bala yeah, never bet time? on yeah, sports yeah, before? He doesn't understand what 25 to 1 means? <laughs> I'm very confused by this conversation. I I've, got like, that yeah, I I've got a couple of thousand on him. Okay. I think he's the best value. Yeah, because 25 to 1 means it's like a 4% chance. Okay. But maybe if he's really good, it could be like a 6% chance or something. I mean, it's, yeah, he's got to win the tournament. Dude. All right. Yeah, yeah it's basically, basically free money. Okay, I'll try. I'll try. Strano. Hi. And then my dark horse is Chris Kirk. You can get him at like 80 to 1. 80 to 1? Yeah, he won so the he first. He has like no chance. Uh, Joaquin Neiman, I like, is he I like the him. Is he the favorite? No, okay. Scotty Scheffler's the favorite at 3.5 to 1. Okay. 3.5? But his wife's How pregnant. So... His wife's pregnant and is due any day, so he yeah, could have yeah, to leave yeah. the, the tournament. How are the odds so crazy, though? Cause... He's very good. He's been winning. Yeah, yeah but like hot. six times as really good hot. as the second guy or something? No. Yeah, because 3 to 1 versus 25 to 1 is like yeah. insane. No, that's... Right? Yeah. Uh, it's, it's just hard to win okay. a tournament in general. Yeah, right. I mean, like that's okay. that's why it's such great. Okay. Outcome. Do you golf yourself, Jesse? I do. Yeah. I, well, I used to be a golfer, and oh, then cool. um, I quit when I was 20. So like 13 years ago, I stopped. Why did you quit so young? Uh, it was my whole life. Like I dedicated my entire life for nine years to it. Oh wow. I was traveling and playing tournaments and competitive and wow. yeah. So yeah. it was. It was a lot. Yeah. And I, I needed. To, I, I burnt out basically. Yeah. How, what, how old were you when you started? Uh, Eleven. Oh wow. Okay. But I played every day, all day. So you did like the whole years. junior circuit, world yeah. circuit. Yeah. Yeah. I traveled the country and played junior golf. Yeah. I'm sure you're still an absolute killer. I got a swing. Yeah. I, I can swing it. You ever been to Top Golf? Yeah. I could oh, yeah, show you a thing or two. The uh, <laughs> the uh, the lodge guys, we all did like a stream appreciation thing. Yeah. We all went to Top Golf. Oh, I bet you killed it. Yeah. Dude. They were I like, bet, "What the fuck?" I bet you killed it. What is that? You were like, you were like "How big is the target?" Doug area? was like, "Why are you playing golf?" Yeah. 16. Got a three bet you one last time. <laughs> Okay. I think Happy Gilmore revolutionized uh, By the way, not an easy game. Brought a lot of people at in. all. Not an easy game. This game's been uh, it's filled with sharks. I mean, T1000, Action Dan, Dylan's playing well, Mariano, Brown Baller. You got some players at this table, no doubt about it. And of course, the pro over there in seat number nine. Five. Oh, you suck. That's a really good value bet. Well, you know Gabriella Sabatini, I've got the best king high. Ace high. Such good value bet. You know how they say, like, never go full retard? Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, you never go full. I don't know anything like that, man. Right. Uh, good night, Jeremy. Have a good one, guys. I'll see you guys next week. So who's, who's For those of you leaving right now, we still got about 10 minutes left, guys. Was you know, that was my life. Yeah. Yeah. Five hours a day on the court. Really? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I was a competitive player. Oh, really? I was top uh, 25 in California. All yeah, of my high school friends play tennis. They're yeah. all coaches in the Bay Area. When it's, you know Ajit. Ajit plays tennis. Oh, yeah. Yeah. 
you make any money? As a coach, I did. High as a player, coach. no. I, oh. It's so hard to make money on the tour. A lot of my high school friends are coaches now. Yeah, yeah. I mean, you just, you, you go into coaching. Yeah. I like being on the back side of the things with, with tennis now. You know, I coach my kids. That's cool. Yeah. Tennis is a great sport. It really is. It really is. I like tennis. Do you make any money in golf? No? No, I, I ended up being the worst golf hustler in the world because <laughs> uh, my swing looked so good, but then I stopped playing so I couldn't score anymore. So when I started playing money matches with poker players, they'd be like, your swing's great, like we're not giving you any strokes, and then I'd shoot like shit. Disaster. You, you hustled in golf or you did it? I got hustled in golf. Oh, you got really? Golf is all about looking ugly and, and shooting well. Like, you want it to look bad. <laughs> so that, and then be able to control your score. You don't want it to look pretty and then not be able to score. Right. Right. Interesting. What about you, Dan? Any sports? Or you just been playing poker since you were like two. <laughs> Dan, Dan is like a three-year-old. Yeah. He's like five high. I'm all in. In Canada, you know? the legal age is six. Oh yeah. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> what about you, man? What's your sport of choice? I wanted to be a pro gamer. Oh yeah. Oh really? Ooh. What game? Uh, Starcraft, Counter oh, Strike, shit. Overwatch. Nice. Oh, yeah. Nice. We should play sometime. Yeah. And then I got a, I got an injury. Sports like injury. Hand injury. Finger arthritis. Uh, Were you serious? No. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't want to be rude, but I was like, you got an no, injury, no. my guy? <laughs> what? I don't know, it was back injuries. I used to play a lot of Dota. Dota? Yeah, I yeah. used to play And League. Uh, what? what? No, Dota. You're it's a video game. game. Oh. It's fun. Is Defense of the Ancients. Oh, okay. Defense of the Ancients. I thought I was about to get done. You know? Lord. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Dota, these nuts. Yeah, I was like, uh-oh. <laughs> yeah, probably. Are you done as well? What is it? Defense of what? The ancients. Defense of the dark arts or something? No, the ancients. Okay. <laughs> That's a fun game. I know you're, you're a school. big gamer, too. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Play a lot. Now I play TFT. Have you played that? No, I haven't played that. Okay. okay. I, you you play, still play? No, I haven't played games in quite some time. But. That sucks, dude. Yeah, when I do, I get I get really obsessive, and then I just don't leave my place. Yeah, that's yeah. fair. Can't put it I down. I used to be like that too when I was younger. Three hundred. Growing up, I used to play like twelve hours a day, like every day. Ten yeah. hundred. I just got back into video games like three months ago, and it's so fun. Yeah. It is a huge fun. waste of time, though. Yeah. Well, but if you're having fun, it's really it, yeah. If it makes gets you relaxed and like is a way to cool off, then yeah. it's not really a waste of time. Forty back, uh, back. The line is blurry though, because does it take me eight hours to get relaxed and <laughs> enjoy yeah, myself? If it's like, yeah, if it's like a, a whole day that gets. Yeah, yeah, the lines are blurry. Yeah, yeah, I used to be like that, but now when I play, I just like play a couple hours here and there. Like I try to do it a healthy way. Yeah. 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 Yeah, I've been playing like with friends online and I never, I always just played like campaign or solo modes. You know what I mean? Back in the day, but recently playing with friends, so much better. Like all this shit talking online, I'm yeah, like, wow, yeah, this is what everyone's yeah, talking about. Yeah. Video games are the best. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> if you can get into it and you have a good group, that's the best. Group. Yeah, dude. I've been meeting a bunch of kids who've apparently had sex with my mom. <laughs> and that's like 80% of the online population. <laughs> yeah. You're I'm like, playing Call of Duty. I'm like, damn, dude. Yeah. Some kid just told you me that. Too. Too. Yeah, Call, like, holy Call of Duty shit. is like that. No, my I play. My friends got like banned a bunch of times. Oh, really? Because he gets into arguments with his blog girls. And... <laughs> yeah, I play Halo, and yeah. dude, those kids are savage. Yeah. I used to play a lot of Halo in high school. Yeah. Me and my friends used to make puzzle maps. Mariano. Creative little bluff. Yeah, I'll six four like, I'll try to be reasonable with these kids, you know. Yeah. Like, hey, I'll be like, hey, bro. Um, 
Next to me. Try to cover me like I'm gonna flank left. Thank you, Lord. Shut the fuck up, pussy. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, okay, I'm sorry. Yeah. Well, I tell you, early on in the show, nobody was talking. By the end of it, I couldn't get a word in, and that's okay. I prefer it that way. I hope you guys enjoyed the show. The last couple of hours of this one were absolutely fire. Uh, if you missed any of it, you can always watch it again on our YouTube channel. Let's take a look at how uh, everybody did. Action Dan, obviously our most active player, our most aggressive player, our craziest player, our wildest player. But did it work for him? Well, he only finished down $9,500. Dylan, by the way, what a roller coaster night it was for him. He finished down 14. Brown Baller down 93. Mariano up 65. Francisco up 50. And that's going to do it for us, guys. For everybody here at Hustler Casino Live, I am David Tuckman, and I am out.